we are ready for liftoff in the 38th World Series to be played in the Bronx. Temperatures right now in the low 50s. They are expected to dip throughout the evening, but we are on time for our scheduled first pitch. Captain Cool, Derek Jeter now in his seventh ball classic and continues that quest for a fifth ring, while A-Rod's unreal October has him just four wins shy of his first. Ryan Howard and Jimmy Rollins are both former NL MVPs, but in Rollins' case, MVP stands for the most valuable predictor. He says the Phils will win it in five games, six if they're feeling gracious. It's the defending champion Philadelphia Phillies and the New York Yankees. Game one of the World Series tonight on Fox. Hi, everybody, and welcome to New York City for the first ever World Series to be played right here in New Yankee Stadium. I am Chris Rose, working alongside the world champion Mark Grace and Eric Karos. And don't say I didn't warn you, but you may have to actually adjust <laughs> the volume on your TV set over the next few games because we have added some serious verbal firepower to this show. The man that led to the White Sox to the Holy Grail in 2005, Ozzie Gian, welcome to the Fox family. You are officially a media member, my oh, friend. Oh, no, no, please. Fox family is fine. Media, no way. Please. Let me hear. Let me hear and let me talk about baseball. Okay, well, let's do that. You played here in New York City in the World Series. You coached here as well. It's a different animal, isn't it? Well, I think when you go to the World Series, and, you know, that's the ultimate thing. I think that's a goal. That's the job you do all summer long. That's the best thing that happened to you. But when you play in Yankee Stadium, that's different scenario. This city is so unbelievable for the World Series, and people go to enjoy this one. Yeah, Yankee Stadium, the biggest stage in baseball. I had a World Series here in 01. My team was victorious over the New York Yankees. However, here in New York, it wasn't so nice. We lost three of the biggest heartbreakers I've ever been a part of. I still haven't gotten over it. Gracie, that, of course, happened across the street at old Yankee Stadium. Let's see if those True. ghosts make the journey across the street as well. Now, this is the fourth time in World Series history former teammates are going to pitch against one another. CC Sabathia and Cliff Lee, teammates for six years with the Tribe. Both have won Cy Youngs, and EK both have been gems so far in the playoffs. Well, they really have. I mean, CC Sabathia, the ALCS MVP. Cliff Lee not getting a lot of hype, but this is a guy that really has had better numbers in the postseason than CC Sabathia. The guy gets by throwing at first pitch strikes. Now, this isn't a Rockies team, and this isn't a Dodgers team. This is a Yankee lineup. It'll be fun to see what happens. Well, CC, to me, wow, I think, believe me, the way he throw in 2009, Post game season series, he's been outstanding. I think it reminded me of Kurt Schilling, just back when he was playing for us in the, in the Marlins. I'm gonna tell this guy go to keep rolling. This guy gotta go to have a tremendous game. I, I'm disgusted with you two. A couple of former hitters, hitters. about nothing oh, but wait, hitters. hitters. <laughs> oh, look at me. I, 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 but can we talk some offense, please? And we know about the Yankees. They're a murderer's row. We know about A. Rod and Jeter. But how about what the Philadelphia Phillies bring offensively to this series? This is the best offensive team in the National League. These guys come out and they are led by Ryan Howard, the former MVP. He drove in 141 runs this year. That tied for most in Major League Baseball. And Jason Worth, he is now. Decided he is a postseason star. Hey, uh, Ozzy, put on your managerial cap real quick. Uh -oh. A-Rod's been so hot in the playoffs. I is he like Barry Bonds was in 2002? Is he that dangerous? Well, I don't know because I think I think you know Alex is chasing a lot of bad pitches. But in the meanwhile, the way this kid's swing the bat right now, the way he's carrying this club to the in the 2009 postseason, I really be careful with him. Yeah, well, I, I got to be careful with Mark to share, and I, I say that yeah. because he hasn't been real hot yet, hitting just over 200, and he had to get hot the last two ALCS games to get the 200. He's dangerous. You want to see home runs? You want to see some offense? I'd love to. You're in the right place in the right series because for just the third time ever, the top two home run hitting teams in all of baseball are meeting in the World Series. The Yanks and Phils combined to leave the yard. Get this, 468 times during the regular season. 12 players clubbed at least 20 big flies. Well, you can see how the two teams stack up right before first pitch at worldseries.com slash Chevy and enter for a chance to win a new Chevy or tickets to the World Series. So may the best team win at worldseries.com slash Chevy. Our guys give their predictions when we come back. They say imports always get the best mileage. Well, do they know this Malibu offers an EPA estimated 33 miles per gallon highway? They, they never, never heard that. Which is better than a comparable Toyota Camry or a Honda Accord. They're stunned. They can't believe it. They, they need, need a minute. I had a feeling they would. Now qualified buyers get 0% APR financing for 60 months on 2009 or 10 Malibu models. The award-winning Chevy Malibu. Compare it to anyone and may the best car win. 
My top pick this season, Applebee's two for 20 game time lineup. One appetizer, two entrees, 20 bucks. Kicking things off, Dan Wingmaster Wilson and Joe Appetacker Davis score with boneless buffalo wings. Second half, seven ounce house sirloin and three cheese chicken penne. Dan goes for the fake, denied. Let's break it down. One appetizer to share, two entrees. Final score, 20 bucks. This deal could go all the way. Two for 20, only at Applebee's. Score. The Chevy World Series pregame show on Fox is sponsored by Chevy and their award-winning cars, trucks, and crossovers. Good, man. Now just a few minutes away from first pitch of game one of the 2009 World Series on Fox. And guys, Jimmy Rollins made his prediction. Phillies in five or six if he's nice. Mark Grace, what do you say? Well, I'm the leadoff man, and I'm going to take the Yankees in six. I like their big three as far as their starters. And it starts with CC Sabathia, A.J. Burnett, and Andy Pettit. I think they're just going to be too strong. But I can be bribed, Philly fans. Yeah, I'm going to go with one of the great thinkers in our country here, Mark Grace. I'm saying Yankees in six as well because of the offense. The Phillies have been off for almost a week, and Ryan Howard has been neutralized by this Yankee staff in the past. Oh my God, uh -huh. you put uh -oh. me in the spot. I uh -oh. don't like to do this. I never will like it. But in the meanwhile, I'm going to pick Phillies in six. Whoa. Only one reason. <laughs> Only one reason. Because get away I, love, I love the way they play the game. Stay and away. a lot of respect for Mr. Jeter, but that's. I hope I'm not run. What's the Come problem here, down here? What are you guys here, doing? Let's get no, no, no. Don't get closer to the New York crowd after you pick against them. That is a bad, bad idea. All right. Well, we are getting ready for first pitch, but first we will have the ceremonial first pitch and the starting lineups when we come back. John Hancock, the future is yours. Visit findtheanswers.com. You don't drink every time you smoke, yet you smoke every time you drink. Drinking and smoking don't have to go together. Relearn life without cigarettes, free at becomeanx.org, a new way to think about quitting. Welcome to the Now Network, population 49 million. Right now, 1.2 million people are on Sprint Mobile Broadband. 31 are streaming a sales conference from the road. 154 are tracking shipments on a train. 33 are IMing on a ferry. And 1,300 are secretly checking email on a vacation. That's happening now. America's most dependable 3G network, bringing you the first and only wireless 4G network. Right now, get a free 3G, 4G device for your laptop. Sprint, the now network. Bob, my office now. There's nothing like the smell of fresh cooked bacon. When it's real, you know. Introducing Wendy's Bacon Deluxe. With Applewood smoked bacon that's fresh cooked, not pre-cooked, on hot, juicy North American beef. This one is the top cleaning model. And with this one, you can wash and dry a load in just 36 minutes. But I think this LG with Steam Care technology would be right for you. It releases wrinkles with the touch of a button. That would be good. Get the top 10 brands only at Sears. Save 15% on all home appliances, including LG. For more, see Sears.com. Sears, life well spent. You're watching Fox Sports in HD. Presented by DirecTV. Terry sits down with Brett Favre and gets his real feelings as he returns to Green Bay. This week on Fox NFL Sunday. Wanda Sykes is coming to Late Night. I'm happy to announce that I haven't slept with anyone on my staff yet. The Wanda Sykes Show premieres Saturday, November 7th on Fox Late Night. Parkinson's has given me something I'm truly grateful for. The chance to make a difference in the lives of millions of patients. 
The Michael J. Fox Foundation does not just fund research, it funds results. By finding the science that will lead to breakthrough treatments. And speed progress toward a cure. The Michael J. Fox Foundation and Fox Sports ask you to join our team. Because it takes a major league effort to strike out Parkinson's. Please go to michaeljfox.org. Welcome back to the Chevy pregame show on Fox. It is time right now to meet both teams' starting lineup for Game 1 of the World Series. For that, we send it up to the public address announcer, Paul Oldham. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome the starting lineups for the 2009 National League champion, Philadelphia Phillies. First, the manager, number 41, Charlie Manuel. Leading off, shortstop, number 11, Jimmy Rollins. Batting second, center fielder, number eight, Shane Victorino. Batting third, second baseman, number 26, Chase Utley. Batting fourth, first baseman, number six, Ryan Howard. Fifth, right fielder, number 28, Jason Wirth. Batting sixth, designated hitter, number 29, Raul Ibanez. Batting seventh, left fielder, number 10, Ben Francisco. Third baseman, number seven, Pedro Feliz. Batting ninth, in the bullpen, the catcher, number 51, Carlos Ruiz. And warming up in the bullpen, the starting pitcher, number 34, Cliff Lee. And now the Yankees starting lineup. First, the manager, number 27, Joe Girardi. Number 27. Leading off. At shortstop, number two, Derek Jeter, number two. Batting second, left fielder, number 18, Johnny Damon, number 18. Batting third, first baseman, number 25, Mark Teixeira, number 25. Batting fourth, third baseman, number 13, Alex Rodriguez, number 13. Batting fifth, in the bullpen, the catcher, number 20, Jorge Posada, number 20. Batting sixth, the designated hitter, number 55, Hideki Matsui, number 55. Batting seventh, second baseman, number 24, Robinson Cano, number 24. Batting eighth, right fielder, number 33, Nick Swisher, number 33. Batting ninth, center fielder, number 53, Melky Cabrera, number 53.
coming up in the bullpen, the Yankees starting pitcher, number 52, C. C. Sabathia, number 52. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2009 American League champion, the New York Yankees. Ladies and gentlemen, please direct your attention now to the microphone behind home plate as we honor our military and veterans for their service to our country. Please welcome a former member of the United States Army's Elite Task Force Ranger Unit who earned a bronze star for valor in the Somalia battles, recounted in the film Black Hawk Down. To sing our national anthem, please welcome Kenny Thomas. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight all the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave Coming up next, the ceremonial first pitch that the president and vice president will not want to miss. That's next. Bones returns with the strangest case yet. Half man, half chicken. And it's going to get messy. Ah! All new Bones, Thursday, November 5th on Fox. Fox Friday. It's two full hours of medicine's most brilliant mind. House? Yes. How many other friends do you have in the asylum? Catch a special encore of the most talked about premiere of the season. Are you a new doctor on the ward? Technically, yes. House. Give me your best poker face. On a special night, Friday at 8, 7 central on Fox. Done. Kids off to school. Better have on the road. It's another frantic morning. But now, it's 9 a.m. Everyone is gone. You made time for your family. Now make time for you. Stick around for an extra hour of news, weather, and a little extra good in the morning. Good day, Philadelphia. Now you can have a good day, too. An $8 billion deficit? Whoever did this should be going to jail. Just raise property taxes. Problem solved. I've got a plan. Chris, Chris dang it. it. I call it don't spend money you don't have. Let me see that. My plan cuts the high property taxes, income taxes, and corporate taxes that are driving families and businesses out of New Jersey. What if I want to spend a bunch of taxpayer money on unions, but I don't have it? You don't spend it. I don't get it. Remember, it's never wrong to vote for the right person. Stand up for New Jersey. Vote independent Chris Daggett for governor. right here. It's easy. It's the money you could be saving with GEICO. Simplifying life. It's something we'd all like to do. Now, you can. When you switch to a Citizens Bank checking account, we'll give you up to $220 just for doing things that you probably do anyway. 
Like using direct deposit, paying bills online, going paperless, and paying with your debit or credit card. $220, just for simplifying your life. That's something one good citizen does for another. Open a new account today and get up to $220. Stopping your family from getting or spreading the H1N1 virus is in your hands. Learn more at H1N1MPA.com or call 877-PA-HELP. Halloween at the World Series. Turn us on, leave us on. Saturday. Welcome back to the Chevy pregame show on Fox. It is time right now for the ceremonial first pitch, and for that we send it back upstairs to Paul Olden. For tonight's ceremonial first pitch, we pay tribute to the men and women of the military who have served our nation so bravely. Joining our ceremonial first pitch honoree at the mound, please welcome a World War II veteran of the D-Day invasion and one of the all-time Yankee greats, Yogi Berra. He is accompanied by the second lady of the United States, Dr. Jill Biden and the First Lady of the United States, Michelle Obama. To throw out tonight's ceremonial first pitch, please welcome a veteran whose sacrifice and dedication to our freedoms are an inspiration to us all. He is a West Point graduate who served in the 1st Cavalry Division in Iraq and was severely injured by a rocket-propelled grenade in Baghdad in August of 2004. His bravery and actions that day have earned him a bronze star with valor and a purple heart. Please welcome retired Army Captain Tony Odierno. First Lady Michelle Obama and Dr. Jill Biden, the wife of Vice President Joe Biden, are attending Game 1 in support of Welcome Back Veterans, an MLB charities initiative that supports returning Iraq and Afghanistan veterans. Well, it is almost game time, so let's send it up to the broadcast booth. Joe Buck, it is all yours, my friend. All right, Chris, thank you very much. A nice moment down on the field prior to Game 1 of this 2009 World Series, and what a World Series it should be. A great matchup. Why? These are two veteran teams. These are two teams that can score in the blink of an eye because of all their power. And let's not forget who the defending champs are. It's the Philadelphia Phillies. They're back to try and repeat. On the other side, you've got the New York Yankees starting this World Series at home. The top record and a very dangerous club in Major League Baseball. Now, I welcome in my partner, Tim McCarver. And Tim, there's so many different ways you can look at this matchup. How do you choose to look at this matchup before game one? I thought it was interesting. You said that each team could score in the blink of an eye. And the reasons for that, the top superstar corners on each team who are at the top of their games, Ryan Howard, the MVP of the NLCS, Alex Rodriguez could have been the the MVP of the ALCS and in baseball you're only as strong as the middle and in the middle for the Phillies it's Jimmy Rollins Chase Utley and in the middle for the Yankees Derek Jeter and Robinson Cano star power abounds and that carries over to the pitching mound I don't think you could have a better matchup here in game one why because in an ironic twist two guys who were teammates with the Cleveland Indians about 15 months ago are facing off in this World Series CC Sabathia and Cliff Lee hook up we get ready game one coming up next what would a World Series be without stars on one side Jeter a Rod, Teixeira on the other Rollins Utley and Howard so what do you say we start this thing game one coming up next. Punk Rock Download, $1. Dance Hall Album, $10. Folk, Japanese Pop, New Wave Hits, $3. The way music makes us feel, priceless. There are some things money can't buy. For music, there's credit and debit MasterCard. 
This is humiliating. Stand still so we can get an accurate reading. Okay, um, 18 pounds and a smidge. A smidge? You know, there's really no need to weigh packages under 70 pounds. With priority mail flat rate boxes from the Postal Service, if it fits, it ships anywhere in the country for a low flat rate. Cool. You know, this scale is off a good seven, eight pounds. Maybe five. Priority mail flat rate boxes, only from the Postal Service. A simpler way to ship. I'm what you call sans parents. Oh. I can go to a movie on a school night like that. In a theater? You should come over to my place. I've got direct TV. I, 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 I get all the hottest movies in 1080p. <laughs> I'm what you call sans cable. Ugh. For theater quality, picture and sound on every channel, call 1-800-DIRECT-TV. drive every time you smoke yet you smoke every time you drive driving and smoking don't have to go together relearn life without cigarettes free at becomeanx.org a new way to think about quitting so words getting out that geico can help people save in even more ways on motorcycle insurance rv camper boat insurance nice work everyone <laughs> well it's easy for him he's a cute little lizard <laughs> uh gecko actually with all due respect, if I was tiny and green and had a British accent, I'd have more folks paying attention to me, too. I mean, well, save money. Pip, pip, cheerio. British? I thought you were Australian. Well, it's funny you should ask, because actually, I'm from... Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. The World Series on Fox is sponsored by DirecTV. No one else has all your favorite channels in HD. By Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance and by MasterCard. Well, what a night. It is chilly, but there's no rain. And so here we go with game one. And a look at the Phillies starting lineup. It's Jimmy Rollins leading it off. He's the shortstop. Shane Victorino bat second. Chase Utley is the second baseman. Then Ryan Howard. What a postseason he's put together. Jason Worth, one of the most unsung heroes in any lineup. One of the better players in baseball. And nobody talks about it. Raul Abania is the DH. Ben Francisco in left. Pedro Feliz at third. And Carlos Ruiz is the catcher. He bats in the number nine spot. And here's a look at the regular season numbers for Sabathia, a 19-game winner, and he has been lights out here in the postseason. Well, I should say so. Not only the postseason, but the second half of the, of the season. He continues that remarkable run that finds him only losing once since July 28. The power change up, and he has changed the grip on his fastball. Dave Island telling us that he has changed the grip the four seam fastball formerly he has gone to the two seam fastball right there and then the cutter that cuts in on the right handed batters and his change up that's that power change up that he throws 86 87 miles an hour before the first pitch tonight's opening pitch brought to you by Budweiser with full flavor and a crisp clean finish it's what we do. For the majority of this day, it didn't look like game one was going to happen. And then about two and a half hours before game time, maybe three hours, the sun popped out. And so here we go. Jimmy Rollins leading it off for the Phillies. And he drops down a bunt right to Teixeira. One pitch, one out. Take a look at the Yankee defense in the outfield. No surprises. Johnny Damon, Melky Cabrera, Nick Swisher. Left to right, Alex Rodriguez, Derek Jeter, Robinson Cano, Mark Teixeira, and Jorge Posada handles CC Sabathia. In step, Shane Victorino. On a 52 degree night. And that misses inside ball one. Victorino went deep, hit a grand slam off Sabathia 
last year during the division series when CC was pitching for Milwaukee as the Phillies made their way to the World Series and then beat the Tampa Bay Rays in five games. A 1 0. <laughs> Ball and a strike. Talked about this so much during the postseason. CC Sabathia, a totally different pitcher now than he was even a year ago. That foul tip caught a piece of Jorge Posada strike two as Victorino went after a pitch that was up and now he's in the hole one and two. It's Victorino now, Chase Utley on deck. And this is a Philadelphia lineup that is very much like an American League lineup. They can come at you really one through nine. My opinion, the only team right now built in the National League to win a World Series is they'll try to go toe to toe with the New York Yankees. Change up on one and two. And a little pop up. To Sherry gives way to Cano. Two out. Tonight's Home Depot tools to victory. For the Phillies, they want to win one game. Obviously, they'll take two, but they want to take one win back to Citizens Bank ballpark. As far as the Yankees are concerned, rally around the hot guys, and that is CC Sabathia and Alex Rodriguez. One guy with his arm, one guy with his bat. And the two carried the Yankees past the Angels in the ALCS. Here's Chase Utley. Strike one. Utley is putting together a brilliant career while playing second base defensively. And you start looking at where he stacks up all time. And you combine on base percentage and slugging percentage. It is eye popping what he's done in his time with the Phillies. That pitch is low, a ball and a strike. In his postseason career, however, just three out of 35 against left handed pitching. Good pitch in under his hands. Strike two. That's where National League pitchers try to pitch Utley inside because he stands right on top of the plate. That's a two seam fastball running in under the hands of Utley. Utley lays off in the count two and two. Talk about Alex Rodriguez coming off hip surgery, which happened in March. Chase Utley had hip surgery in November. During the regular season, hit 31 home runs. In fact, Alex Rodriguez called Chase Utley for counsel prior to his operation. Now a 2 2. Full count. What kind of a year did Utley have with the 31 home runs? Well, he's one of four players in this Phillies lineup with 30 or more home runs. Yankees had seven in their lineup with 20 or more. Trying to keep this top of the first alive for Ryan Howard. And he does with a two out walk. How about Ryan Howard rookie of the year in 2005 MVP National League 2006 and he's had four straight seasons with 40 or more home runs 130 RBIs and was the MVP of the National League Championship Series and as you can see some of the raindrops hitting our camera lens. Down at the end of the dugout as Howard digs in he steps in with 14 RBIs this postseason two home runs and an average of 355.
Strike one from Sabathia. Remember the fastball in on the hands of Chase Utley. That's how the Yankees will try to pitch Ryan Howard. Breaking balls away. Try to get him chased to chase out of the strike zone once you get ahead. And fastballs in on the fists. And that's a rocket down into the right field corner as Swisher goes to dig it out. Utley heads for third and he is held by Sam Perlazzo. It's a double after the walk and the Phillies have second and third with two out here in the first inning. Watch Jorge Posada set up inside off the plate. And the pitch from Sabathia came back over the heart of the plate. And Ryan Howard doesn't miss those. A tracer to right field. And so an early opportunity now for Philadelphia. It started with a two out walk. And it lands in the lap of Jason Worth. And I said during the lineup portion of our first inning that this is one of the best players that nobody talks about across baseball. What a season 36 home runs that was the seventh best total in the National League second and third two out and worth takes a pitch off Jason worth was platooned with Jeff Jenkins in the outfield last year and right after the All-Star game went into Charlie Man Manuel the manager and said I think I should be playing more often Charlie said you know what you're going to get a chance and Jeff Jenkins got hurt worth got the chance and here he is. The All Star takes a strike. Worth's last game this postseason was a two home run game in game five of the NLCS against the Dodgers. The 1 1. Ball two. So first inning trouble for Sabathia. First base is open. The Banez on deck. Billy's trying to get a lead for their starter Cliff Lee. Way high with a fastball and it's three and one. The pattern for Sabathia against the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim when he was behind in the count he went away to right handed batters. The power change up is not out of the realm of possibility here. And he gets the outside corner with that pitch full count. Eighty seven mile an hour change up on the corner. When to try to overpower and when to tease. Three two. And that will load him up. Two walks a double in the middle of them. And the bases are loaded with two away. That looked like a little cut fastball on the outside that missed went around the plate and the Phillies have loaded him up here in the first inning and it brings in Raul Ibanez. Ibanez handles left handed pitching. In fact a better average against left handed pitching during the regular season than against right handers. 285 average compared to 267 bases loaded for Philadelphia. And a ball down and away from Sabathia. Check swing foul left side one and one. Home plate umpire is the crew chief first time he's been a crew chief in the World Series this is his fourth World Series 26 years in the big leagues Jerry Davis 
Jeff Nelson at first Brian Gorman Mike Everett at third Dana DeMuth down the left field line and Joe West down the right field line. Rollins tried to bunt his way on. Made an out. Victorino popped up with a walk, a double, a walk. And it's Ibanez in his first year with Philadelphia. Taking ball two. A 22 pitch first inning for Sabathia right now. Base is loaded, two balls and a strike. Ibanez will get a fastball right here, try to capitalize. And Breaking ball. And it misses low ball three. Three and one. That's why breaking ball in that count is dicey. You've got the bases loaded, no place to put Ibanez. And Sabathia goes to the breaking ball that misses. And now he most assuredly will get the heater. Three one pitch is chopped to second. Two hops to Cano. And after all that, the Phillies come up empty. A hit, two walks, leave the bases loaded. A half inning in the books in the World Series. No score. Let's get down to the nuts and bolts. You've got things to do. We've got the tools and hardware to get them done. And with new lower prices all through the store. So you can do more fixing, replacing, fastening, and updating for less. More saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. Right now, trade any power drill, working or not, for 15% off a new lithium-ion drill. The Blackjack Taco is here. Behind this mysterious black shell is Taco Bell's classic crunchy taco with pepper jack sauce. Come in after dark on Halloween and get one of these tacos free. 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 It's not a trick. It's our treat. <laughs> Chuck's going to show us how simple it is to earn cash back. Talk about simple. Earn cash back on purchases to pay down your credit card or go into savings with the Power Rewards Visa credit card only from Bank of America. You know what I want? You know what I wish? You know what I'm looking for? Uh, I'm listening. What do you got? I want less waiting. I want less clutter. Just less click. Not that. Loud and clear. I want a whole lot of less. Bingo. I wish it was just faster. Easier. Leaner. Meaner. Safer. Cleaner. Simple. 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 Come on, man. I know you can do this. Absolutely. Now we're rolling. Now we're talking. I'm a PC. I'm a PC. In Windows. In Windows 7. Was My idea. My idea. My idea. Thank you. Today marks the beginning of a new era in South Africa. He was a prisoner. As President Mandela takes office in Pretoria. He became a president. This country is hungry for greatness. We need your help. What did he want? I think he wants us to win the World Cup. It was a game that changed the world. Morgan Freeman. This is the time to build our nation. Matt Damon. This is our destiny. A Clint Eastwood film. Invictus. Ready PG-13. Starts December 11th. The World Series is sponsored by Taco Bell's free blackjack taco giveaway. Visit TacoBell.com for details. By the Home Depot, more saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. And by Bank of America, Bank of Opportunity. Take a look at the Yankee starting lineup. Derek Jeter leads it off. He is the shortstop. Johnny Damon bats second and left. Mark Teixeira hits third, the first baseman, and Alex Rodriguez. Putting together a brilliant postseason here in 2009. Jorge Posada, Hideki Matsui, the DH, Robinson Cano, Nick Swisher, and Melky Cabrera is the center fielder batting ninth. And that group is facing this left-hander who has been terrific with the Philadelphia Phillies, not just in the regular season, not just him right after they got him. But here in the postseason, virtually unhittable. Two, two and zero oh, in 24 and a third innings in the postseason. He has struck out 29 and walked only three. He works lightning fast, and he can match Sabathia's changeup. He cuts the ball in on the right-handed batters. That keeps them from diving out to the outside part of the plate. Very similar equipment to Sabathia. Jeter first in there for New York. Oh. 
Strike one. The grips, uh, interesting. If you'll notice up here, I had never heard the term spiked curveball, but you notice how the forefinger is tucked in, and that allows him to get on top of it, the change up in the four seam fastball. And we'll tell you how we found out about that spiked curveball. That was it. Just nasty break, and Jeter taps it foul on two. There it is right there, tucking that index finger under. And that's called a spike curveball. Carl Willis, the pitching coach of the Cleveland Indians, told us about that spike curveball in an interview with him yesterday from Durham, North Carolina. Here's an 0-2. And a good start for Cliff Lee as he strikes out Jeter on three pitches. It's about as good as you can do, and Cliff Lee makes a statement with the first hitter tonight for New York. That looked like a cutter, so after the spike curveball, the cutter out of the strike zone gets Jeter. And brings in Johnny Damon. Johnny Damon, of all the pitchers who are active across the big leagues, he has his lowest average against Cliff Lee, just two out of 22. And he takes ball one. Here's a 1 0 and a tap foul one ball one strike. Yankees 36 and 18 against left handed starters here in 2009. And for Cliff Lee. Trying to keep the bases clear in front of Teixeira who has handled him and looks like he's done just that two out. An easy play for Cliff Lee, and now Damon is two out of 23. Lifetime against Cliff Lee, and here comes Teixeira, who during the regular season hit 39 home runs, drove home 122 runs. Those are the top totals in the American League. His three RBIs in the American League Championship Series came on one swing of the bat against Darren Oliver with the bases loaded. Strike one. So Cliff Lee, who had never pitched in the postseason before, and who has rolled through his opponents so far, whether it's been the Colorado Rockies or the Dodgers, comes out here and starting World Series game number one, strikes out that guy, and then gets Johnny Damon on a bunt attempt, falls behind to share a two and one. And wants to talk to Ruiz. That's a change up to Teixeira that stayed low. But once again, the control of Cliff Lee is remarkable. 29 strikeouts and only three walks in 25 innings in the postseason. Fastball away. On two and one. And it's two and two. You can tell at home what the fastball with nobody on at second base a pinky is a fastball away not only a fastball but it gives location too. the index finger would be a cutter inside like this one. And to share strikes out what a first inning for Cliff Lee we go to the second game one Phillies and Yankees no score. Now, wherever cough and cold strikes, there's new Robitussin to go in a neat little single-dose spoon. Liquid medicine, already dissolved, ready for your body to take in. New Robitussin to go. Pure Robitussin relief to go. I get so worried today when someone in my family gets the flu. Fact. Advil not only relieves body aches and pains that can come with the flu, it also reduces fever fast. Relief doesn't get any better than this. Advil. It's got plenty of pickup. You don't even really feel like you're driving a hybrid. And it's only a four-cylinder, but man, this thing hauls. It really does. I mean, if you want me to show you, I'm sure I sure can. Back for a limited time at Chili's. Three courses, two people, $20. Start with a shared appetizer. Choose two entrees from over 15 Chili's favorites, like our new better than ever baby back ribs. Then share a dessert. Chili's, three courses, two people, $20.
little things can turn against you when you travel. But if they do, you know who to turn to. Your American Express Charge Card not only gives you assistance around the world. With the Membership Rewards Program, you can use points to travel without blackout dates on any airline, anytime. Can your card say that? There is a scale of measurement for alien encounters. The first kind, sighting. Oh my God. The second kind, evidence. What is this? The third kind, contact. Scott. The fourth kind, abduction. On November 6th, the truth isn't waiting to be found. It's waiting to be believed. The fourth kind, rated PG-13, starts November 6th. These leaves are a little gauge, and they tell you how efficient you are with your miles per gallon. I have gotten the, the little tree pretty big. Wanda Sykes is not afraid to tell it like it is. From the news. The divorce rate is down. That's no surprise in this economy. People are too broke to break up. To current trends. Do we need yet another report saying Americans are overweight? Don't most of us have mirrors? To real people. Have you ever eaten a vegetable? Just anything green? Nobody's off limits. The Wanda Sykes Show. Premiere Saturday, November 7th on Fox Late Night. Chevy and baseball have teamed up to give fans a chance to win tickets to the postseason. And even better, you have a chance to win a new Chevy. Just register at WorldSeries.com slash Chevy and may the best team win. Here is Ben Francisco. What an opportunity for this outfielder, Francisco, who came with Cliff Lee in the trade that brought Cliff from the Indians to the Phillies. Happened on July 29th. Francisco kind of a throw in the Phillies and in particular Charlie Manuel really like what they have at five home runs in 97 at bats with Philadelphia and the counts 2 and 0 oh from Sabathia Charlie telling us before the game that uh, Francisco is a much better player than he thought he was when initially acquired. Here's a 2 0 oh. and now 3 and 0. Oh. Seven days of rest for CC Sabathia who his last time out on three days of rest shut down the Angels in game four of the ALCS eight innings one run five hits there's a strike and it's three and one. Now the 3 1 Francisco fouls it out of play full count. Left side in Rodriguez to his left. One out. How about more about Karsten Charles Sabathia, 2007 Cy Young Award winner with the Indians, traded to Milwaukee. Brilliant down the stretch, but lost in the postseason. Signs with the Yankees in December, and after winning 19 games during the regular season, 3 0 with a 1.19 ERA. This postseason. And as you can tell, that smile lights up a camera, doesn't it? He has an infectious personality and doesn't seem to worry about much. One of the reasons why I'm sure it worked out here right out of the gate for the most part in his first year. That big contract, $161 million to come to the Bronx. He went over the numbers first 22 starts he was good he was 10 and 7 the Yankees were 11 and 11 but the last 15 starts since the first of August he's lost only once. Cheater guides it over to first with that wet baseball and two ground outs start the second. 
we've been talking about nothing but weather since the postseason started at least when we've been here in New York it's 52 degrees it's raining it's misting said the weather had moved out of here but most came prepared because it was just a nasty day and it wasn't misting all day it was pouring. They told us Tim it was going to stop. It's back. There's Ruiz. Pa have to be patient with our <laughs> weather brethren. Strike one to Carlos Ruiz. They're just trying their best. Yeah. That's all right. Base is empty, two out. Ruiz chops one to the right side. Cano. Three ground ball outs as Sabathia comes back from that 3 0 count to Francisco to start the inning. An inning and a half, no score. It's understood that if you get up to get a Budweiser, you come back with a round. How you carry that round is a matter of personal preference. There's the six pack strangler, the St. Bernard, the flock of geese, the marsupial, the Sherpa, the claw, even the more advanced. Labrador Retriever. But we always come back with a beer that starts with full flavor and ends with a crisp, clean finish. It's what we do. Budweiser. When you search for a car at autotrader.com, we send more cars your way than anyone. A lot more cars. So you can narrow it down by model, the color, even the price. Search from the largest selection. That's the one. You get the car you want at the price you want. Autotrader.com, the ultimate automotive marketplace. Hello, I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC. Hey, Mac, did you hear the good news? Right. Windows 7 is out, and it's not going to have any of the problems my last operating system had. Trust me. I feel like I've heard this before, PC. What? Windows Vista's here, and it's not going to have any of the problems that Windows XP had. It's not going to have any of the problems that Windows ME had. It's not going to have any of the problems that Windows 98 had. It's not going to have any of the problems Windows 95 had. It's not going to have any of the problems Windows 2 had. Trust me. This time it's going to be different. Trust me. This is the card that bought the saw. That cut the lumber. That built the extra space I needed to store more produce. That she sold to me to make my menu more organic. Introducing Ink from Chase, the card that helped make it all happen. Because it's accepted in twice as many places worldwide as American Express, with reward points worth 25% more when redeemed for air travel. Make your mark with Ink. Go to chase.com slash ink. Chase what matters. Let's play. Family moments cost less at Walmart. Xbox 360 and Forza Motorsport 3 at unbeatable prices. Rated E for everyone. Save money, live better. Walmart. It's not over. Get the number one DVD in America today. Transformers. Buy it on DVD and Blu-ray for as low as $14.99. The World Series on Fox is sponsored by Budweiser with full flavor and a crisp, clean finish. It's what we do. Well, Cliff Lee couldn't have been any better in the first. He struck out two. He got Johnny Damon to bunt back to him for out number two. The strikeouts were of Jeter and Teixeira. And now Alex Rodriguez, Jorge Posada, and Hideki Matsui will bat for the Yankees. No score. Bottom of the second. First World Series at bat in his 16 year career for Alex Rodriguez. And offensively, Alex Rodriguez is the biggest reason why the Yankees are in the World Series here in 09. Strike one from Cliff Lee. Thirty home runs during the regular season, 100 RBIs. Twelfth straight year he has reached both those plateaus in the same season, and Cliff Lee is sharp here early. 
A quote by Alex Rodriguez that he has rediscovered the joy of baseball. The 0 2. And that is foul out of play off to the right as the rain and the wind pick up a little bit here in the bottom of the second. And just to go through the numbers, the last three postseasons for Rodriguez coming into 2009. He hit a combined 159 with one RBI, which came on a solo home run. That is it. That's a ball, ball one. He went 0 for 20 with runners on base. This year he's hitting 412 with runners on base. And here in 09, he has three game tying home runs in the seventh inning or later. Three of his five. And he strikes out to start the second. Man, you talk about razor sharp. Cliff Lee with the cutter to get Rodriguez. Three strikeouts in his first four batters. Cliff Lee, one and one against the Yankees this season. He actually made the start for the Cleveland Indians when the Yankees and Indians opened up this stadium on the 16th of April. He and CC Sabathia faced one another. Ball one high. In that game Cliff Lee got the win. Sabathia was OK. The bullpen imploded for New York that day. Here's a foul off to the right one and one. Jorge Posada, a career 208 hitter during the World Series, and he takes inside two and one. Seventh World Series for Posada. A two one. Three and one. Good spot for Posada here. He will get a good fastball to hit. Count three and one. Hitters look inside. Try to jerk one. And instead he floats one into right. And the Yankees have their first base runner of game one. Base hit Posada with Matsui coming up. Good hitting uh, by Posada. Now I, I guess all pitchers have rituals. And the one thing in talking to Carl Willis, the Cleveland Indian pitching coach yesterday, he said, before every inning, watch Cliff Lee. He'll wind his arm around three times and do a simulated pitch off the back of the mound to, to visualize the drop when he turns and throws toward home plate. He struck out Rodriguez. Posada got a hit, and now Matsui takes ball one inside. Hideki Matsui hitting 233 this postseason. Seven out of 30 with a home run, five RBIs. Another lefty, Cano, is next. That's inside again, 2 0. Oh. Looks like it's raining a lot harder on the mound than in his home place. <laughs> when we show it that way. Hitters have all the advantages. <laughs> Here's a 2-0. There's a strike. 2-1. Talk about the difference, Tim. With the mound and the plate, and at the release it's 91 miles per hour. At the plate, 83 miles per hour. That is our Fox Tracks Plus, and that is strike number two on Matsui, two and two. I think as much as anything, Joe, it does uh, that little gadget uh, gives you an idea of how quickly a hitter has to react to a pitcher's pitch, determine whether it's a strike or not, and swing. The blink of an eye. And a changeup gets Matsui as we peek into the glove of Cliff Lee. Strikeout number four. 
There you could see uh, we talked about it in the American League Championship Series with CC Sabathia about whenever that ring finger becomes involved then a change up is the pitch. The pitcher will throw the ball with the index and middle finger. But when that ring finger becomes involved then a slower pitch is forthcoming. Here's Robinson Cano. Thing is from a hitter standpoint you can't pick that up. And Cano flies one into center. Victorino back to get it. We go to the third. Pitching has dominated to this point. No score in game one. Hi, my name is what? My name is who? My name is Chickens name Shady. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the eighth wonder of the world. H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo, Hi to the Izzo, What the Izzo, H to H to the Izzo, H to the Shady, H to the Shady. That's the anthem. Get your me. hands up. Jay Z versus Eminem, one of 93 original mashups. DJ Hero, rated T for Teen. Need these minutes anymore? We got that calling circle thing everybody else has. It's AT&T's A list, Don, and it's not the same. We get unlimited calls to any ten people on any network, but unlike everyone else, the minutes we save, we keep. So. So why save minutes with your calling circle if they just expire at the end of the month? You're using that one. Introducing A list with rollover, unlimited calling to any ten numbers on any network, and keep the minutes you save only from AT&T. I really don't know where to start. Yeah! I have kids. Twins. Welcome to fatherhood. You want to connect with these kids? I'm going to help you. The kids have never seen Friday the 13th, part one or two. Oh, my God. I'm just kidding. Where a man can be a man. You made fire. Get the car ready. And only the strong survive. My kids are in there. Sorry, the zoo closes at three. We're in the gorilla enclosure. Oh, dogs. Ready, PG. I'm all out of luck. So long. They were supposed to perform for game one. The weather was so bad they couldn't rehearse. So tomorrow night is the night, and we look forward to that, and so should you. And you can join us as our coverage starts at 7.30 Eastern, 4.30 Pacific. Here is Jimmy Rollins, top of the order for Philadelphia. No score. And Rollins, who tried to bunt his way on, pushed it right to Teixeira his first time up. He's 0 for 1. And 10 out of 42 this postseason. Victorino, then Chase Utley. That's strike one. And speaking of music, Jimmy Rollins appeared in several MC Hammer videos in the late 80s, just like you, Tim. <laughs> MC Hammer used to uh, work for the Oakland Athletics. That's right. Yeah. Of course, Rollins and Sabathia grew up about 35 miles apart. Two and two. Jimmy grew up in Oakland, and CC Sabathia growing up in Vallejo, California. Two balls, two strikes. Posada wants it up. He gets it right at the mitt, and it's a full count. Here's the 3 2 pitch and a fly ball well hit into left center field. Back at the track, caught by Cabrera. This ballpark, the ball is just not carrying in the postseason. The Yankees played one game this year on June 18th where no home run was hit by either team. They played two here in the postseason. 
The Yankees have hit two. The opposition has hit zero. Nada. So Jimmy Rollins talking to himself back in the dugout. Ryan Howard thinking about and at bat he has the only Philadelphia hit there were two walks around that double in the first inning but Sabathia got out of trouble by getting a Banez. first pitch a ball to Victorino and the next from CC Sabathia ball and a strike Jimmy Rollins is one of those electric personalities as you look at strike one on Victorino and he went so far as to predict a Philadelphia victory in this World Series and predicted that it would happen in five games Phillies in five said J. Rowe that is hammered down the left field line but foul I'll tell you that pitch there that was similar to the grand slam that Victorino hit against Sabathia last year cut fastball up and in. I don't know whether CC is going to come back inside to Victorino. If you're Shane, you look for that pitch away. On one and two. And a check swing didn't go around. Two and two. Held up. Victorino trying to get on in front of Chase Utley. A 342 hitter during his career in the postseason with two strikes. And he grounds to short. Two bounces to Jeter. Two out. This World Series is a Northeastern World Series. I-95. About a two hour drive, depending on how close to the speed limit you want to go. Under 12 bucks in tolls, you cross two rivers, the Hudson and the Delaware, rest stops five, which is something you need to know if you're going to make the drive. Yeah, they're even calling this the Amtrak series. And when these two teams met 59 years ago in the World Series, 1950, the New York Yankees beat the Phillies four in a row. And the the Wiz kids were beaten by the New York Yankees. Here's Utley. There's ball one upstairs. This is the seventh World Series for the Philadelphia organization. They're two and four in the previous six. They won in 1980 over Kansas City, four games to two, and they won last year, certainly behind Charlie Manuel. Over Tampa Bay. Here's a foul back and out of play. One ball, one strike. On the other side, you've got the Yankees. They just wrapped up their 40th pennant. And so they're in the World Series for the 40th time. This is the 105th World Series as we play here between New York and Philly. The Yankees have won 26 World Championships. But none since 2000 when they beat the Mets. Strike two on Utley. And a look at the interior of this brand new facility. First year at the new Yankee Stadium. Yankees won it all in the first year at their old Yankee Stadium, 1923. The 1-2. 2-2. Two. Two Shook off three breaking balls and then a fastball away. I think he wants to come inside on Utley. You encourage pitchers to shake you off. 
I mean, after all, they're the ones who have to make the pitch. Now he shakes off. He wants to change up. He shook off the fastball inside. Still two and two. Chase Utley with that first inning walk has now reached base by a hit walk being hit by a pitch in 26 straight postseason games. Trying to get on again in front of Ryan Howard 2 2 pitch and a pop up left side Rodriguez is out of room. First year in the new stadium, the Yankees won it in 1923. Lost in the World Series during the renovation. And here they are in 2009 in the Fall Classic. Again, the 2 2. And again, a foul ball. These two lineups would love to make these starting pitchers work here tonight to try to get at either the middle or the setup relief in each bullpen. Already the 53rd pitch of the night and it's ball three up and in to Chase Utley. So the Phillies have made Sabathia work. And Sabathia does not look as sharp as he has the first three tries this postseason. That ball is hit down the right field line into the corner. Back at the track, it is 1-0 Phillies. Utley goes deep, and Philadelphia strikes first in game one. Second home run this postseason for Chase Utley, and that quiets this packed house at Yankee Stadium. Jorge Posada put down the index finger, fastball away. Sabathia, a fastball in the fat part of the plate. And it was Utley who had 31 home runs during the regular season to get the first one here in the World Series. Third career World Series home run for Chase Utley. He went deep twice last year against the Rays, and now Ryan Howard takes ball one low. So there is the first home run hit against the Yankees here at this Yankee Stadium this postseason. As they play their sixth home game. A 1 0. Yes. Howard went around, one ball, one strike. Joe, he fouled off some very, very tough pitches, did Utley. Fouled him off the other way and finally caught up to that fastball. The 1 1 from Sabathia. 96. Gets that look on the face from Ryan Howard as Sabathia gave the Phillies first baseman his best fastball of the night. That was an after a home run fastball there. A little extra anger in that fastball. And he ties up Ryan Howard to end the top of the third, but. The Phillies score first, and it's their second baseman, Chase Utley, going deep. One nothing Philly after two and a half. Nothing gets NFL fans pumped up like winning a trip to the biggest games of all. Between now and November 30th, 
Using your Visa card gives you a chance to win tickets to an NFL playoff game, the Pro Bowl, and Super Bowl 44. More people go with Visa. The Blackjack Taco is here. Behind this mysterious black shell is Taco Bell's classic crunchy taco with pepper jack sauce. Come in after dark on Halloween and get one of these tacos free. free. It's not a trick, it's a treat. <laughs> these all seem the same. They're not. You can't fake Sony quality. It makes watching sports in HD better. And the more sports you watch on a Sony, the better you get at sports. I can do this all day, football star. Oh, oh it's on fire. It's on fire. Sports look better on a Sony Bravia HD TV. says lightning never strikes twice. Introducing a supercharged new BlackBerry Storm 2. Wi-Fi enabled, ultra responsive, tons of apps. And because it runs on the network with five times more 3G coverage than AT&T, it just may be the perfect storm. drink every time you smoke yet yeah, you smoke every time you drink drinking and smoking don't have to go together relearn life without cigarettes free at becomeanx.org a new way to think about quitting every day our brave troops and their families stand up for us for years we've asked so much of so few now we have a chance to serve these heroes to give time, offer comfort, or lend a hand. To ease the burden on a military family. Let's honor their service by volunteering ours. Crisp. That's how you would have to describe this night and the pitching stuff of Cliff Lee after two. Four strikeouts, the one hit, no walks, around the plate with everything. He misses barely. Ball one, a little extra look in at the home plate umpire, Jerry Davis. One to nothing, Philadelphia on the home run by Chase Utley. And now a ball and a strike on Nick Swisher, who is just four out of 32 this postseason. The one one falls down two and one it'll be Swisher then Cabrera then Jeter against Cliff Lee who really hides the baseball well when he brings it home and Swisher pops it up Wind plays with it a little bit and Ryan Howard hauls it in. One away to start the bottom of the third inning here in the Bronx. For each home run hit in this 2009 postseason, MasterCard will donate $1,000 to Stand Up to Cancer. 47 home runs have been hit. $47,000 pledged by MasterCard. For more information, visit StandUp, the number two, cancer.org. Really groundbreaking research being done to fight that awful disease. So definitely worthwhile you checking it out. Stand up to cancer.org as Melky Cabrera takes a strike. And now the next from Cliff Lee down and in one ball one strike. Cabrera his first eight postseason games hit 148 his last seven he's hit 370. Had a good ALCS and he's in the hole here one and two. Ball 
Or you could see that cutter cutting down and in to Melky Cabrera. And Cabrera pops it up right side for Utley. Two out. And nothing very loud off the Yankee bats so far tonight. Join Major League Baseball in helping our returning veterans. Log on to MLB.com or WelcomeBackVeterans.org for more information on how you can make a difference. And now with two out, nobody on, here is Jeter who struck out his first time up. Pass Ryan Howard down the right field line and gets to the corner. Jeter will get to second with a two out double. We talked to Joe Girardi before the game about whether the Yankees would try to slow down Cliff Lee. And sure enough, Jarek Leader, uh, Jarek, Derek Jeter was very deliberate before stepping into the box there. He took his time. As he often does, he put his right hand up, and sure enough, on the first pitch, he doubles down the right field line. But that is part of the Yankees' strategy tonight, is to try and slow down the motion of Cliff Lee. He's working very, very fast and working to his rhythm and not to the Yankees thus far. There's Johnny Damon after the double. Ball one. Derek Jeter started this night with a career 414 average during the postseason against left-handed pitching. And he is now 12 for 29 in his career against Cliff Lee. Damon takes a strike. Damon struggled in the division series went one for 12 against the twins hit in a simulated game during the break before the ALCS went yep. nine for 30 and a weak wave at that pitch strike two. The American League left fielders against left handed pitching will play Johnny Damon over toward the line Francisco and left field is not nearly over toward the line as most American League left fielders would do they would be I think five feet to the right particularly against a left handed pitcher because Johnny Damon's more apt to go the other way with two strikes and he breaks his bat hits it to third for Feliz who gets the out Pedro Feliz one of the best defensive third baseman in the game takes care of Damon Lee takes care of the Yankees and after three in game one one nothing Philadelphia. Hi there, I'm Jack. And a while back, I got an idea right in there. You know what it was? Make my PC simpler. So what did I do? I passed it along to Microsoft. Next thing you know, Windows 7 and this new Snap feature. Now, if I'm working at two things at once, I just drag this over here, this over here, Snap. Simpler. Pretty much exactly what I told him. I mean, I'm not trying to take all the credit. He called his mother. Of course I called her. She needed to know this. I'm a PC, and Windows 7 was my idea. Coach Romeo! These Coors Light cold activated cans just told me the beer's cold. Yeah, they told me they were excited and they were happy. Uh, wait, the cold activated cans told you they were happy? Sure. Did the cans tell you anything else? They said congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> When the mountains turn blue, your beer is cold and ready for kickoff. Coach, if all of your cold activated cans can talk, what happens when you open your fridge? Generally, there's hoopla involved. Hoopla? Today marks the beginning of a new era in South Africa. He was a prisoner. As President Mandela takes office in Pretoria. He became a president. This country is hungry for greatness. We need your help. What did he want? I think he wants us to win the World Cup. It was a game that changed the world. Morgan Freeman. This is the time to build our nation. Matt Damon. This is our destiny. A Clint Eastwood film. Invictus. Ready PG-13. Starts December 11th. Let's get down to the nuts and bolts. You've got things to do. 
we've got the tools and hardware to get them done. And with new lower prices all through the store. So you can do more fixing, replacing, fastening, and updating for less. More saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. Right now, trade any power drill, working or not, for 15% off a new lithium-ion drill. Richard, is this your coat? <laughs> Don't do it. Bad guy in a little coat. Bad guy in a little coat. Great. I'm here with tons of fun when I could be at home watching DirecTV. No matter what I want to watch, it's in sweet, beautiful HD. But no, I'm stuck with either cable or that. What's happening? <laughs> Never gets old. To get the most TV for the money and lock in your price for an entire year, call 1-800-DIRECT-TV. The World Series is sponsored by DirecTV. No one else has all your favorite channels in HD. By X, relearn baseball without cigarettes, relearn life without cigarettes. And by Windows 7, your PC simplified. We welcome you back. It is the fourth inning, one to nothing. Philadelphia on the home run by Chase Utley. That was last inning. Sabathia brings inside. it home and inside ball one to Jason Worth. Last two seasons, including the postseason, you see what he's done against left handed pitching 31 home runs, most across baseball. Had a chance to visit with Joe Girardi, the Yankee manager. And we'll play that for you during this fourth inning. Up above tonight's aerial coverage. Brought to you by DirecTV. For the most sports in HD, call 1 800 DirecTV. Rain has let up quite a bit. And the 1 1. Change up foul back, and that's strike two. Some of the celebrities who are here tonight Mark Messier, Mayor Giuliani, Alec Baldwin. Kate Hudson, Kerr Russell, Jeff Gordon. Here's a one two. Two and two. Cut fastball missing to Jason Worth. I'll tell you, Jason Worth can handle that pitch inside. I think the Yankees may show it to him, but then go back out there, make him reach. The pitch Posada finishes the play one out here's our visit with Joe Girardi and the first question was about what he's seeing so far from his left hander Sabathia he hasn't been quite as sharp with the location of his fastball and they've gotten him in some long counts uh, he's done a pretty good job of minimizing the damage to the solo home run to Utley but uh, they've made him work hard and it looks like you're going to have your hands full with Cliff Lee yeah he's uh, doing a good job of getting ahead of our hitters elevating at times when he's ahead throwing the cutter He's done a nice job so far. Have you been told anything about this weather? Is this something that uh, that's on your mind? Uh, not really. I, I think we're going to get some drizzle during the course of the night, but I think we should be okay. I think the heavy stuff is gone. Congratulations on winning the pennant and being here in the World Series. Thanks, guys. All right. Second year as manager of the New York Yankees, the 45-year-old Joe Girardi, who has three rings from his days as a player with the New York Yankees, playing for Joe Torre. 96, 98, 99. Good fastball from Sabathia and a Cal one and one on Ibanez. Blows this one by Raul. We talked about the signing of CC Sabathia. What about the Phillies and the, the foresight of signing Raul Ibanez? He signed on December 16th, one of the great postseason signings in recent history. And he is fooled on that pitch, strike two. That's the second check swing of the night to Ibanez. You know what I mean? I mean, most teams, they win a World Series. They don't go out and sign free agents. The Phillies knew they had a weakness in left field. They immediately signed Ibanez. And has he ever delivered this year? A one, two. And that skips in there. It was the right move. A lot of money, but it turned out to be the correct decision made by Ruben Amaro Jr. who is the general manager 
The taking over for Pat Gillick for the Philadelphia Phillies and a very talented general manager is Ruben Amaro. Helping to put this team together for Charlie Manuel. A career high 34 home runs for Ibanez in 09, and he strikes out for the third consecutive strikeout for Sabathia. Two out here in the fourth. And the curveball released at 80 miles an hour, but in the hitting area, 75 miles an hour, and Ibanez with a little under a half a second to react. Not a lot of time and frozen on the curveball. So for Sabathia, no strikeouts until two out in the third. After the home run by Utley, he has struck out the next three batters. That is over but low. You see the HK on the chest of Ben Francisco. That's to honor the late Harry Callis. And his sport coat hanging in the dugout for the Phillies. Passed away on the 13th of April. Beginning part of the season and the longtime terrific voice of a sweet man Harry Callis was silenced and his Philadelphia club as his initials on the chest as they play here in 2009. 2-0 pitch is flied into center right at Cabrera. Four in a row retired by Sabathia. Cliff Lee rolling on the other side. Heart of the order coming up for the Yankees down by one. Well-informed people are considering Chevy Malibu. You a cop? No. You didn't hear from me, but this Malibu, it offers better highway mileage than a comparable Camry or a Cord. Estimated 33 highway. I saw that on the EPA site. So how come the Malibu costs so little? It's a Chevy. You have cop hair. Now qualified buyers get 0% APR financing for 60 months on 2009 or 10 Malibu models. The award-winning Chevy Malibu. Compare it to anyone and may the best car win. This is John Park's restrictive calling circle. He's saying toodaloo and switching to Sprint with any mobile, anytime. Now on the Sprint network, he can call any mobile phone on any network anytime he wants without worrying about the meter running. So he's decided to call every mobile phone in the country. He'll finish just after his 93rd birthday. Welcome to the Now Network. Get unlimited calling to every mobile phone nationwide when you switch to any mobile anytime. Only from Sprint, the Now Network. Depression is a serious medical condition that can take so much out of you. I feel like I have to wind myself up just to get out of bed. Then, well, I have to keep winding myself up to deal with the sadness, the loss of interest, the trouble concentrating, lack of energy. If depression is taking so much out of you, ask your doctor about Pristique. Pristique is a prescription medicine proven to treat depression. Pristique is thought to work by affecting the levels of two chemicals in the brain, serotonin and norepinephrine. Tell your doctor right away if your depression worsens or you have unusual changes in mood, behavior, or thoughts of suicide. Antidepressants can increase suicidal thoughts and behaviors in children, teens, and young adults. Pristique is not approved for children under 18. Do not take Pristique with MAOIs. Taking Pristique with NSAID pain relievers, aspirin, or blood thinners may increase bleeding risk. Tell your doctor about all your medications, including those for migraine, to avoid a potentially life-threatening condition. Pristique may cause or worsen high blood pressure, high cholesterol, or glaucoma. Tell your doctor if you have heart disease or before you reduce or stop taking Pristique. Side effects may include nausea, dizziness, and sweating. For me, Pristique is a key in helping to treat my depression. Ask your doctor about Pristique. They begin the dream at an early age. From the first time they put on a glove. Diving snap by Teixeira. Or grip a bat. Jimmy Rollins has made his mark. They imagine playing on the world's biggest stage. A blast by Jeter. This is when they get their chance. The chance of a lifetime. To make it all come true. This is beyond a childhood dream. Watch the World Series on Fox. It is a World Series that features 20 All-Stars, three former MVPs, three former Cy Young Award winners. And that includes the guy who will take the ball for Philadelphia tomorrow night here at Yankee Stadium, Pedro Martinez. 
will take on A.J. Burnett. Right now, one to nothing, Philadelphia. Bottom of the fourth inning, heart of the order for the Yankees to share a first up. Struck out his first time. Took a ball. And now another, 2 and 0. Oh. Slow start to the ALCS for Teixeira. Had four hits and four RBIs the last two games. As that series went six. 2 0 -oh pitch is in for strike one. We had a chance to visit with Rich Doobie, the pitching coach for the Phillies during the last break. He watches Lee on two and one and now two and two. Try to get that interview to you here in the bottom of the fourth. Rich in his fifth year with the big league club is their pitching coach and eighth year in the organization for Philadelphia. He's done a nice job. 2 2 pitch and another strikeout for Cliff Lee and first question was obviously about the left hander for Rich Doobie and how well he's pitching. Well, he's throwing the ball very well right now and he's been in a good run for us so, uh, so hopefully I'll continue. How in the world Rich does he hold that breaking ball and have the control with that one finger sticking into the seam like it is. Well a lot of guys throw that spike curve ball now and you, you become uh, accustomed to doing it that way so even with the cold weather he's got good feel for it and it's a big pitch for him. And I know that baseball teams don't like to look ahead but the final questions about your starter tomorrow night Pedro Martinez is a legitimate guy who wants the baseball in big games and you have your right hander going tomorrow. Yeah we put Pedro in between uh, Cliff and Cole, uh, Cole Hamels and just puts the two lefties plus uh, Pedro's pitch in this type of environment in this city so many times. We appreciate your time Rich. Thank you. All right. Thank you guys. Right. Nothing in two the count on Rodriguez who is set up for another strikeout and Lee has struck out five through three and a third. Here's that pitch that Rich Doobie is talking about. And you can see that index finger. And there is the spike curveball. That was to Derek Jeter earlier. Rodriguez hops out. And now too far inside drives Rodriguez off the plate a ball and two strikes. This Yankee team was 13 and 15 without Rodriguez in their lineup. Rehabilitating after that. Hip surgery. And then finished 90 and 44 and what a run they've been on here at home. Too far inside again two and two. You may have noticed Carlos Ruiz shaking his head three times getting Cliff Lee to shake his head along with him and they came back with the same pitch the inside fastball catchers will do that a lot they'll get the pitcher to shake his head with him and then come back with the same pitch here it is again fastball high full count. Talked about the Yankees record at home 36 and 8 here in their new home stadium since the All Star break. 5 and 0 oh here at home during the postseason. Change up. And another strikeout for Cliff Lee the sixth of the night and he has four against the combination of Teixeira and Rodriguez. That was an interesting pitch on the three two count Cliff Lee and Ruiz started Rodriguez off with the changeup and finished him off with the changeup. It's a pretty good job of pitching right there changeup five fastballs changeup to get it. And now Posada who has one of the two Yankee hits. Phillies have only two hits but one of them left the park off the bat of Chase Utley. Ball one outside. That 
Strikes out of play. One and one. Yankees led Major League Baseball in home runs with 244. The Phillies led the National League in home runs with 224. There are actually two teams that will steal a base as well. Phillies had the top stolen base percentage over 80 percent during the season across the big leagues. And we're number two overall with 119 stolen bases. They come at you a lot of different ways. So far it's been those two guys Lee and Sabathia and one swing by Utley. Two and two. So Cliff Lee could strike out the side here in the fourth inning. Seven strikeouts on the night. We go into the fifth inning as Cliff Lee took care of Teixeira. Alex Rodriguez and then Jorge Posada. One to nothing Philadelphia back after this from your local Fox station. Favre returns to Lambeau. Fox NFL Sunday delivers this week. Dance's top nine couples must raise their game. Phenomenal! Because the judges must send two more home. All new dance this Tuesday at 8, 7 central on Fox. Responsibility. Stories define us. And having a co-anchor like Carrie Lee next to you, you know what she's thinking. You know what she's going to do. You know you can trust her. And that's a good anchor. Carrie Lee Halkett and Thomas Drayton. Fox 29 News, weeknights at 10. When my daughter was born... We brought her home in our new Toyota Camry. 16 years later, she learned to drive in that very same car. I've learned to trust Toyotas. That's why they're the only cars I'll ever buy. Get something you can trust, like the Toyota Camry. You can lease one for just $189 a month or get 2.9% financing for 60 months. To learn more, visit toyota.com. Yes, your love. What do you think? Hey, why don't we use our points from Chase Sapphire and take a break? We can't. Sure we can. The points don't expire. There is nothing There's no travel restrictions. We could leave tomorrow. We can't use them for a vacation. You can use the points for just about anything. I know. Chase what matters. Get your new Chase Sapphire card at chase.com slash sapphire. The good news continues during Hyundai's Extra Extra sales event. First, we made news with Hyundai Assurance. Now, Elantra is making news. Named J.D. Power's highest-ranked compact car in initial quality. Elantra comes with extra big savings, along with the extra coverage of America's best warranty. And better fuel economy so you can go the extra mile. Good news, great deals. Hurry to your Hyundai dealer. Extra incentive. Get two grand cash back on the Elantra. Hurry, offer ends November 2nd. What would you give for more time with your family, your dreams? What would you do to stop your cancer? The answer is the Abramson Cancer Center at Penn. With treatments tailored to a patient's own biology and major breakthroughs like cancer-fighting vaccines, Penn Medicine has more ways to treat your cancer and save your life. When faced with cancer, when you need a reason to hope, your life is worth Penn Medicine. What a day Sunday will be here on Fox. The Giants at the Eagles at 1 Eastern, a battle for first in the NFC East. The Vikings at the Packers with Brett Favre's return to Green Bay in the late window at 4.15 Eastern. And then we will have game number four of this World Series for you at night. All of that in high definition here on Fox this Sunday. Pedro Feliz grounded out his first time. And there are his numbers in his postseason career. Ruiz will follow and then Jimmy Rollins against Sabathia. 
And it seemed like the home run by Chase Utley kind of steered CC Sabathia back into the right lane because he has been really good with three consecutive strikeouts. He got Francisco on a fly ball out, and he's 0-2 on Feliz. And now he strikes him out. Strikeout number four for Sabathia. Both left-handers dealing with a great deal of confidence now on the 0-2 pitch. Feliz is called out. Here comes Ruiz, who checked into this game hitting 385 over his last 13 postseason games and giving the Phillies big hits from the bottom of their order during the postseason. His numbers date back to game two of last year's World Series and he takes ball one. How ironic that this game one of the World Series would feature the matchup of Sabathia and Cliff Lee. Former teammates pitched here in April when the Yankees opened their new home park for the regular season on the 16th. And trying to see who gets the leg up in this World Series here tonight. Lee traded from the Indians to the Phillies at the deadline and the count now one and two on Ruiz. Sabathia found his Cleveland Indians two years ago three games to one up on the Boston Red Sox. The Red Sox came back and won three in a row and CC saying that he used to always love to watch the World Series. Well that year in 2007 he did not see the World Series he said he couldn't stand to watch it. And here he is in it two years later. Here's a one two to Ruiz. Left side ground ball for Jeter. And that's out number two. And Ken Rosenthal I know you know more about the relationship between CC Sabathia and Cliff Lee. Joe they are very close. In fact Cliff Lee considers CC Sabathia his best friend in baseball. After they faced each other in that game you referenced earlier first game at the new Yankee Stadium they went back to CC's house. And Lee couldn't help but tease his friend. He said, Dude, what was your problem? You couldn't put us away. Well, he's trying to do it here tonight, albeit against a different team. That's when Lee was with the Indians. I think the ride of Cliff Lee is even more remarkable, which we'll get into in the bottom of the inning. Strike one on Rollins. And there you go. Former Indians. You still have LeBron. Clock's ticking. <laughs> 3 and 0 for Sabathia. 2 and 0 for Cliff Lee. And just one run on four total hits in that matchup here tonight. Now Rollins is set up at 0 and 2. See Posada setting up for the high fastball, and he gets it. Rodriguez Sabathia has retired seven straight halfway through game number one. They move Monument Park across 161st Street to the new stadium. One nothing Philadelphia into the bottom of the fifth. Sometimes the little things in life feel like our biggest enemies. They can be damaged. They can be stolen. Happily, your recent purchases with the American Express charge card can be repaired, replaced, or your account can be credited. Can your card say that? Now you can get the latest Sony Bravia HD TVs where you already save. The amazing quality of Sony Bravia from the leader in unbeatable prices. Save money, live better. Walmart. I have an offer to make. 
If you push the button, you will receive one million dollars. Someone in the world will die. Is that something we can live with? The Fox, rated PG-13. I'm what you call sans parents. Oh. I can go to a movie on a school night like that. In a theater? You should come over to my place. I've got direct TV. I get all the hottest movies in 1080p. <laughs> I'm what you call sans cable. For theater quality, picture and sound on every channel, call 1-800-DIRECT-TV. Hello, folks. Good to see so many of you back here again. You all excited? Hi, yeah. Kids, you all excited? Yeah. All right, well, hang on. You're going to experience fall like never before. Nothing says fall like Dunkin' Donuts. Try our pumpkin lattes, muffins, and donuts. Like the fall season, these flavors won't be here forever. Dunkin' Donuts, America runs on Dunkin'. Try any of our authentic hot lattes, including our pumpkin latte, for just 99 cents. This is Jim. He returns everything. Keep your friends close and your receipts closer. And this is his new Chevy. What sold you? I can return it. Of course. Now on top of Chevy's five-year, 100,000-mile powertrain warranty, they're offering their 60-day satisfaction guarantee. Now when I buy a new Chevy, I can return it within 60 days if I'm not thrilled. Just one problem. What's that? I'm thrilled. Change is good, Jim. The 60-day satisfaction guarantee from Chevy. The World Series on Fox is sponsored by Chevy and their award-winning cars, trucks, and crossovers. We go into the bottom of the fifth inning here at Yankee Stadium. The Yankees coming to the plate with Matsui, Cano, and Nick Swisher. One to nothing on the home run by Chase Utley. Cliff Lee is taking care of the rest. He has struck out seven, walked nobody, and allowed two hits, and his stuff is popping here tonight. First time former Cy Young Award winners have met in game one of a World Series since Greg Maddox and Oral Hershiser did it in 1995. <laughs> It's 0 and 2, and both pitchers, for the most part, have been sharp. Sabathia not as sharp tonight as he has been his first three starts, still very good. And he's now retired seven straight after the home run by Utley. It's allowed two walks and two extra base hits. That's low. Ball one. And predictably, Joe, when you're in the bottom of the fifth inning and no leadoff batter has gotten a board for either side you're going to have a low scoring ball game and that is certainly the case this evening and that just missed two and two the pace of Cliff Lee just drips with confidence it really does Charlie Manuel wanted that curveball just a wee bit outside. Setting up inside and just missing. And now it's a full count. Sometimes a manager sitting on the bench can't tell whether the ball is inside or outside, but he'll go on the reaction of his catcher, in this case, Carlos Ruiz. And up the middle, that's a leadoff base hit. And the Yankees do put their leadoff man on for the first time tonight. So with that, we give you our autotrader.com ultimate pitcher comparison, autotrader.com, the ultimate automotive marketplace. Cliff Lee now four-plus innings. sabathia has gone five. Lee's allowed three hits. Sabathia is allowed a home run walk two. 81 pitches for Sabathia. He's still in the 60s, and here's Robinson Cano.
Ball one. Both teams have won seven games this postseason. And five of the seven for each team has been a come from behind victory. One and oh on Cano. He fly to center his first time up. Good fastball from Lee. Strike two. A couple of disputed calls on Matsui. He got a 3 2 fastball. Robinson Cano disputing this call, saying he didn't go around. If the bat head doesn't cross the plate, normally a third base umpire to a left handed hitter will not call that a strike. Yeah, I didn't think he came close. I didn't either. So the count one and two. And now a little flare to the shortstop and out they're saying Rollins caught it in the air and now back to first base is Matsui this is going to be interesting let's look he caught Rollins, that yeah, Rollins that's caught a catch. the ball they got the wrong guy on first base that's right and then Matsui took off. Howard is off the bag Matsui left the field and Cano is standing at first base. Yeah Chase Utley comes over to Ryan Howard saying tag Matsui tag Matsui. It doesn't matter whether Cano is out or not. Now you can see Rollins saying tag Matsui. He tagged the right guy that should be a double play. It should be. Now the umpires get together to talk it over and see what everybody saw Rollins it looked like was trying to let it bounce right to turn the six three double play but in the end they got the right call with Rollins catching it in the air but Matsui wandered off Howard tags him out it should be two out nobody on instead for some reason Cano is standing at first base which makes no sense I think uh, what second base umpire Brian Gorman's going to do is get help from the other umpires and if the ball did not hit the ground and Rollins had leather under it and it, that was clear then Matsui wandering off the base but Howard tagging him that's a double play. Well it's good to see him huddle up and get together and try to get this call right. There's been so much conversation about further use of instant replay during the postseason. Let's see what the call is. They're both out two out they got it right. They got it right. And Joe Girardi is going to get the explanation from the home plate umpire and crew chief Jerry Davis but this is the right call. You know the interesting thing Joe and you had it right immediately. I think Jimmy Rollins by going to the bag right there he made a bad throw but I think he wanted to short hop that ball. But by putting leather under the ball that means the batter Cano is automatically out Matsui wandering off the bag and the Phillies inadvertently get a double play. And it was the right call. So now two out nobody on in the bottom of the fifth inning. And the batter is Nick Swisher. So for the umpires who have been under fire this postseason for mistakes made. They deserve a lot of credit for initially getting that call at least confused if not wrong and then getting together in the middle of the diamond to get it right. And they did just that. So two out nobody on and a 1 0 pitch is over but low 2 0 to Nick Swisher who's 0 for 1. I think Jimmy Rollins saw that Robinson Cano was not running hard out of the box. That's why he tried to short hop the ball and then he went to second base after he had caught it. Swisher pops it up. Shallow right. 
Utley says he wants it, but Worth calls him off, and the inning is over. A hit, a double play. Nobody left after five. All Cliff Lee and Chase Utley. One nothing, Philadelphia. People think that Honda is always the most fuel efficient choice. Well, the Chevy Cobalt XFE has better highway mileage than a comparable Honda Civic. The all new Chevy Equinox has better mileage than Honda CRV, and Chevy Malibu has better mileage than Accord. However, Honda does make something that we just can't compete with it's self propelled. Introducing the 60 day satisfaction guarantee. Buy a new Chevy, and if you don't love it, we'll take it back. The Blackjack Taco is here. Behind this mysterious black shell is Taco Bell's classic crunchy taco with pepper jack sauce. Come in after dark on Halloween and get one of these tacos free. 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 It's not a trick. It's a treat. <laughs> It was a horrible feeling, like I couldn't catch my breath. I couldn't believe I was actually having a heart attack. I remember being at the hospital, thinking about my wife. I should have done more to take care of myself. Now I'm exercising, watching my diet, and I trust my heart to Lipitor. Unlike some other cholesterol-lowering medications, Lipitor is FDA-approved to reduce the risk of heart attack, stroke, and certain kinds of heart surgeries in patients with several common risk factors or heart disease. Lipitor is backed by over 17 years of research. Lipitor is not for everyone, including people with liver problems and women who are nursing, pregnant, or may become pregnant. You need simple blood tests to check for liver problems. Tell your doctor if you are taking other medications or if you have any muscle pain or weakness. This may be a sign of a rare but serious side effect. I'll never forget what I went through. Don't take your health for granted. Have a heart-to-heart -heart with your doctor about your risk and about Lipitor. Fox is sponsored by Verizon Wireless. Get baseball stats and news on your phone with the Fox Sports Ultimate app from Verizon Wireless. Tonight's aerial coverage brought to you by DirecTV. For the most sports in HD, call 1-800-DIRECTV. Sabathia back to the hill. He's retired seven straight. Victorino first up, then Utley and Howard. Two, three, and four hitters. For Philadelphia, up on the Utley home run, ball one. And now ball two, two and oh. Victorino has popped up, grounded out. Phillies come into this World Series with six days off, just like they did last year. Charlie Manuel had a simulated game on Sunday to try to keep his team fresh. The Yankees had their ALCS end on Sunday night. And a strike makes it three and one on Victorino. Victorino pops it into shallow left center field. The wind takes it out to Cabrera. Eight straight. Retired by Sabathia. One out top of the sixth in the in-game box score. For the Phillies, brought to you by Fox Business Network, the new home of the American Dream on DirecTV. 
channel 359 or check your local listings and you see just the two hits but one of them left and that was off the bat of Utley who digs in now he's also walked. Sabathia's walked two, allowed a double, a homer. Cliff Lee has walked nobody, struck out seven, allowed two singles and a double. <laughs> Otley takes strike one. Chase Utley will rarely chase the first pitch. About 80 percent of the time he will take strike one obviously sees a lot of pitches because of that excellent two strike hitter as he proved his last time up <laughs> strike two in this at bat with one out in the sixth Because of a postponement and the longer schedule for this postseason since the end of the regular season these two teams have had 14 days off and have played nine games. With a count of 0 and 2 one out nobody on. The next is ripped foul down the right field line just foul and Utley almost didn't leave the batter's box. Now, there aren't too many hitters left handed hitters against left handed pitchers who can get around on that pitch that tight pitch with two strikes like Utley because most guys will be guarding the plate and they're not as quick inside but Utley still with those lightning hands even with two strikes. Coming back inside. And a shot into right. Utley has gone deep again. What a night. 2 nothing Philadelphia. Chase Utley with two home runs with two strikes. Here's the sign from Posada. CC did not want the breaking ball, so he comes back inside, does not get it inside, gets it over the fat part of the plate. It's similar to the last home run he hit. Put a charge in that one. That ball was pounded. Chase Utley, Tim, came into this series with people wondering if he was okay physically. He fouled a ball off his right foot toward the end of the regular season. Still working his way back. We talked about the hip surgery during the offseason. He went just four out of 19 against the Dodgers, but here tonight he's walked once, homered twice, and it's the Chase Utley Cliff Lee show for the Phillies here in game one. I remember last year trying to uh, find out whether. Whether Chase had a bad hip. And his word to the media and everybody was, my hip's fine. Right after the season, he had it operated on. <laughs> but he does not want to get out of games. Talk about a guy who plays hurt as a throwback to another era. Greatest word you can compliment a player is to call him a gamer. And boy, you're looking at one right there. Here's a 1 1. One ball, two strikes on the last guy to go deep twice in a World Series game. Last year in game four. Ryan Howard tonight has doubled, struck out. And that is fouled off his foot or leg. Let's go back to the first home run in the third hit by Utley. Outside part of the plate, really right down the pipe. And here's the second home run almost in the identical spot Two nothing Phillies.
The one two to Howard is down and away two and two. Ryan Howard with more RBIs over the last four seasons than anybody across baseball and the fourth best total over a four year span in the history of the game. And he strikes out for the second straight time. That's strikeout number five for Sabathia. Good breaking ball from Sabathia gets Howard. The Yankees in the bottom of the sixth inning will have Cabrera, Jeter, and Damon. If anybody gets on to Shera. Here's Jason Worth. Two out, nobody on. Worth is 0 for 1. Off the end of the bat, strike one. Funny, Joe, when you when you think about Chase Utley and how close he stands to home plate, uh, pitchers don't want to hit him. He was hit 24 times. That was the most in the majors this year. But when he's not getting hit, what he does, he pushes the ball from the inside part of the plate out over the fat part of the plate. Which really is is ideal for a guy who's a pull hitter like Utley is. You don't want to hit him if you're a pitcher. So instead of coming in and and missing inside, you end up missing over the fat part of the plate. For a guy who can hit like Utley, that's not a good place to miss. One and one. Pitch misses up and now two balls and a strike worth. Walked in the first. That's when the Phillies loaded the bases for Ibanez, who had the count in his favor, eventually grounded out. Cliff Lee has been in charge from the beginning for Philadelphia. And Sabathia now has allowed three extra base hits, two walks. As he misses high with ball three, three and one on Worth. With two out. Off the end of the bat, Cano to his left, can't get to it, and it's a two out single for Jason Worth. If you're a first baseman you have to make your mind up immediately whether to field the ball like that it looked like to wanted to go after it, his first instinct that there was a hesitation there and Cano went after it and it, even had he made this play I don't think he gets worth Jason runs too well. And speaking of that now CC Sabathia will have to watch worth who loves to get a jump and run. The 100th pitch of the night coming from Sabathia. Instead, it's a throw over to first for Worth, who so far this postseason doesn't have a steal, but despite all the power, 36 home runs, he stole 20 bases and might be the best athlete on this Philadelphia Phillies team. That's right. Worth looking at Davy Lopes. Davy Lopes, one of the great base stealers of his era. Second baseman for the Los Angeles Dodgers. Talk about a guy who knows what he's doing at first base. Big rip by Ibanez. Strike one. Davy Lopes at first base coach, three times played in the World Series against the Yankees. Well, with the Dodgers. 77, 78, and 81. That is strike two on Ibanez.
The 37 year old Raul Ibanez in his first year with the Phillies. And Ibanez strikes out. Two home runs in this game for Chase Utley. The first one on the 59th pitch of the night from Sabathia. The second on the 90th. And after five and a half, two nothing Philly. Hello, I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC. And I'm an XP user who's getting ready for the big move. You're gonna love Windows 7. To Mac. Oh, what? Well, they say moving to Windows 7 would be a fresh start, yes. but the real fresh start would be moving to a computer like Mac, who's rated number one in customer satisfaction. I mean, look, I could stick with what I know. Yes. But what I know is pain and frustration. Oh, uh, why don't you just make up your mind? I did. I'm gonna go with Mac. Oh, great. Well, you don't have to rush into anything. You don't have to make up your mind. <laughs> well, hey, glad I caught you. I was on my way to present ideas about all the discounts we're offering. I've got some catchphrases that'll make these savings even more memorable. All right. Good driver discounts. Now, that's the stuff. How about this? They're the bee's knees. Why this? Sir, how about just 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance? Huh, yeah. Good luck with that catching on. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. On November 6th, we don't fight with guns, we fight with our mind. <laughs> Clooney, Bridges, McGregor, and Spacey are the men who stare at goats. You're a psychic spy. That's correct. Access to favorite courses. Chef's meal with palm free. Perhaps a night at the theater with extra special seats. Additional hotel night, our treat. Your world in perfect harmony, priceless. Look for world on your MasterCard to get rewards and offers that matter to you. There have been many versions of the social greeting. The fist bump has been thrust into and out of vogue. The low five was cool for a while. The chest bump had its day, as did the outlaw, the forearm grasp, and the point and go. In certain circles, the headbutt, and of course, the bro hug double back tap combo. But one greeting stands the test of time with the beer that starts with full flavor and ends with a crisp, clean finish. It's what we do, Budweiser. You're gonna want to see this. Russian fringe science. You wouldn't believe what those pinkos were up to. Bad guys don't stand a chance. Fringe. Viewer discretion advised. All new Thursday, November 5th on Fox. Well, there's a pitching matchup that was talked about so much coming into this game one. And so far, Cliff Lee has had the better of his buddy CC Sabathia as we go to the bottom of the sixth inning. Melky Cabrera first up. 2 nothing Philadelphia on the strength of two Chase Utley home runs and a strike from Cliff Lee. And Cabrera didn't agree with the call. Melky Cabrera in that game against the Angels when he had the three hits driving in two runs with a double is his fourth time up had a bunt base hit his first time up in that game and now he's in the hole what Cliff Lee is just doing a terrific job of staying ahead and finishing off Yankee hitters tonight. That's the spike curveball grip. And it's in the dirt. Ball one. On one and two. Cabrera off the end of the bat into right. For Jason Worth. One away in the bottom of the sixth. 
Take a look at this scene before us. It's game one of the World Series and it's a Verizon game summary. You can summarize this game very easily. Two swings of the bat from Chase Utley. Two home runs. And the suffocating pitching of Cliff Lee. Here's Jeter one for two. The only extra base hit of the night for the Yankees and he takes a ball outside. Cliff Lee came up from the minors with the Indians in 02. 14 and 8 in 04. 18 and 5 in 2005. A 14 game winner in 2006. But then it gets interesting. The 1 0 pitch. 2 and 0. 5 and 8 and hit by injuries in 2007. Was injured during the spring, came back, was ineffective, was sent to the minor leagues. And when the Indians were in the ALCS in 07, he was not on the roster. Last year, he won the Cy Young as Jeter gets a base hit. And the reigning AL Cy Young Award winner will face the tying run at the plate with Johnny Damon coming up. Second hit for Derek Jeter and the Yankees trying to get two men on base in one inning. They have not done that thus far. Damon is 0 for 2. The pair ground outs. Two for 24 in his career against Cliff Lee. He was 7 and 9 with the Indians when he was traded to Philadelphia with Ben Francisco for four players on July 29th. The club option on Cliff Lee through next season. Started out 5 and 0 after five starts with the Phillies. And he's been brilliant this postseason. Ball one to Damon. Just joining us, mist has been falling pretty much since the beginning after a day of heavy rain in the New York area. 2-0 to Damon is fouled back. The matchup of Cliff Lee and CC Sabathia. 51 degree night. Wind has died down a bit since the beginning. Here comes a 2 1 to Johnny Damon. 2 and 2. Trying to come inside, and he does inside part. And again, it's two strikes on Damon. We talked about it his first at bat with two strikes. You have to play him shallow in the off field. Francisco could be in another three steps. That's the type swing that Damon takes with two strikes. Johnny cuts down on it and that limits him hitting the ball a long way to left field. Now he can pull the ball but the left fielder is really not responsible for the ball's head down the right field line. The 2 2. Poking at it and fouling it left side. Staying up there with a 2 2 count against Lee, who's pitched 29 innings this postseason and allowed two earned runs. Wow.
Little pop up. Lee will take it himself. <laughs> Made that look easy. That was a rather nonchalant grab. The guys in the World Series. That's out number two <laughs> here in the get, sixth. Get excited, will you? <laughs> <laughs> Ho hum. <laughs> <laughs> that had to draw smiles from every teammate except the ones on the field. <laughs> Here's to Shara. One on, two out. The three, four, five hitters in this Yankee lineup combined one for six with five strikeouts. So Lee has saved his best stuff for the heart of the order for New York. Ball one. I wonder just wonder if Cliff Lee was thinking about dropping that ball and throwing the first and perhaps getting Jeter going to second base. Don't know. That's going to be my first question for him tomorrow. Two and oh the count on to Shara. With the dangerous Alex Rodriguez on deck. <laughs> There's the catch and. There's the reaction from his manager Charlie Manuel. Here's a ground ball up the middle taken by Utley who steps on the bag before Jeter can get there and we go to the seventh inning. Game one of the World Series two nothing Philadelphia here at Yankee Stadium. On Saturday night November 7th don't miss the premiere of the Wanda Sight Show at 11 o'clock 10 Central on Fox. Hold on that's too much information just keep it simple. Wanda Saturday. Fox late night. That's just too simple. Do we still have to pay him? Yes. Don't miss Super Big Sunday on Fox 29. First, Eagles, Giants. Then, Barb wears purple and green bay. Followed by the Phillies and Yankees in the World Series. Turn us on and leave us on Super Big Sunday on Fox 29. We love it here in Philly. The fans are awesome, but I'm on one coast, my family's on the other. Comcast makes it really easy to stay connected. I talk to my grandma in San Diego all the time. We talk as long as we want. It's great. Comcast's a winner in my book. Cole Hamels knows. For unlimited nationwide calling, 12 popular calling features, and phone service rated number one in call clarity, the right call is Comcast Digital Voice. Call now and get service for just $19.99 a month for six months. I have Comcast Digital Voice. You should too. Prostate cancer. How do you decide on a treatment? Fox Chase Cancer Center has all the options all in one place. Our expert doctors guide you in choosing the treatment that's best for you. State-of-the-art surgery, including Da Vinci robotic surgery for faster recovery. The largest, most experienced IMRT program, or brachytherapy. For the best options in prostate cancer treatment and prevention, choose Fox Chase. Call 1-888-FOX-CHASE. Hi, welcome to TD Bank. Hi. Welcome to America's most convenient bank. Hey, welcome to America's most convenient. Oh, hi, ladies. Welcome. Thanks. Welcome. 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 Regis, what are you doing? TD Bank is America's most convenient bank, and to prove it, I've been holding this door all day. It's America's most convenient bank because it has legendary service, hassle-free banking, and the longest hours around. You can say that again. With locations from Maine to Florida, TD Bank is America's most convenient bank. Kia presents the $18,200 Optima versus the $18,200 Accord. The Optima has class-leading fuel efficiency. The Accord does not. The Optima has a five-star crash rating. The Accord does not. The Optima has an industry-leading warranty. The Accord does not. The Kia Optima. With features they can't beat at a price they can't match, there's really nothing to compare. Now starting under 15.7 after up to $2,500 cash back. Warner Brothers Pictures Invictus from director Clint Eastwood. It stars Matt Damon and Morgan Freeman. It's in theaters everywhere December the 11th, and it tells the inspiring true story of how Nelson Mandela joined forces with the captain of South Africa's rugby team to help unite their country. That's from Clint Eastwood, Invictus, in theaters December 11th. As we go into the seventh inning, and Ben Francisco first up. Pedro Feliz, then Carlos Ruiz, the seven, eight, and nine hitters against CC Sabathia. Two nothing Philadelphia, and 
And the count goes to 2 and 0 as Phil Hughes gets loose for the Yankees in their bullpen. There's a strike, two and one. Phillies lead at two nothing. They've gone 18 and five over their last 23 postseason games. The reigning world champs lead game one. Two one pitch is low. Three and one. Asking Joe Girardi about the possibility of CC Sabathia coming back in game four and starting that game, he said it depends on what happens tonight. And that was the 108th pitch that Sabathia has thrown on the evening. Popped up right side, foul ball, and it is out of play. So the count full three and two. Game two is tomorrow night on Thursday night. It's A.J. Burnett against Pedro Martinez. As Charlie Manuel had a flair for the drama of sending Pedro Martinez to the mound here in New York at Yankee Stadium against him, A.J. Burnett. Here's a 3 2 to Francisco. And it's a leadoff walk. Third walk of the night for Sabathia. And with Feliz coming up, how much longer will Joe Girardi stay with Sabathia? A, he's been a little off here tonight, and B, like you say, and, and you read my mind, is the possibility of bringing Sabathia back on short rest for game four. Yeah. Well, the one thing that Charlie Manuel does not like to do is bunt. Sacrifices are few and far between for the Phillies. And the result, five, four, three, double play. Rodriguez to Cano and then on to Teixeira. And just like that, two out, nobody on for the team that had the second fewest sacrifices in the National League during the regular season. Lace really with a good pitch to hit but right at Rodriguez who turned it easily. And the bases are empty for Ruiz. In the bottom of this seventh it'll be Rodriguez Posada and Matsui the four five and six hitters against Cliff Lee. Foul strike one. Joe would like to send our sympathies and thoughts along to Marvin Miller the former executive director of the Major League Baseball Players Association uh, Marvin's wife Terry passed this morning. The most influential man outside the lines in the history of baseball in my view and a person who should be in the Hall of Fame. That's right. Right at Rodriguez his throw is good enough. And we are at the seventh inning stretch of game number one. Two nothing the Phillies lead it on a windy rainy night here in the Bronx. And this matchup of the best from the NL against the best from the AL. A look at the Statue of Liberty and now we bring you back inside Yankee Stadium in the Bronx and we take it to the public address announcer Paul Olden. Please rise and remove your caps. Please direct your attention now to the microphone behind home plate and welcome the official vocalist of the West Point Band United States Army Sergeant First Class Mary K. Messenger. In honor of the service men and women stationed around the globe she will now perform God Bless America.
U.S. Army Sergeant First Class Mary Kay Messenger as we go to the bottom of the seventh inning. Game one of the World Series. Heart of the order coming up for the Yankees. Down 2 nothing. Today marks the beginning of a new era in South Africa. He was a prisoner. As President Mandela takes office in Pretoria. He became a president. This country is hungry for greatness. We need your help. What did he want? I think he wants us to win the World Cup. It was a game that changed the world. Morgan Freeman. This is the time to build our nation. Matt Damon. This is our destiny. A Clint Eastwood film, Invictus. Ready PG-13, starts December 11th. Look at that. What, 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 David was the Xbox champion of the family. Until the night, Andrea crushed everyone. <laughs> including our champion. Uh-oh. I thought he'd take it hard, but... Good job. Turns out, he was actually kind of proud of her. Family moments cost less at Walmart. More games and more fun with Xbox 360 at unbeatable prices. Save money, live better. Walmart. There's nothing you can do that can't be done. There's nothing you can sing that can't be sung. There's nothing you can say. Get for a dollar. That's yours. How far can I get with this? You can get out. Hi. What can I get for this? How about two sizzling 100% pure beef patties with all the amenities and a meaty, melty McDouble? Or maybe an irresistible McChicken, golden fries, or any of the fabulous dollar menu tastes that are always here for you. Huh? Wow. The dollar menu every day, only at McDonald's. They say imports always get the best mileage. Well, do they know this Malibu offers an EPA-estimated 33 miles per gallon highway? They, they never, never heard that. Which is better than a comparable Toyota Camry or a Honda Accord. They're stunned. They can't believe it. They need, need a minute. minute. I had a feeling they would. Now qualified buyers get 0% APR financing for 60 months on 2009 or 10 Malibu models. The award-winning Chevy Malibu. Compare it to anyone and may the best car win. The World Series is sponsored by Walmart. Save money, live better. Walmart. By Warner Brothers Pictures Invictus from director Clint Eastwood in theaters everywhere December 11th. And by Chevy and their award-winning cars, trucks, and crossovers. Shots of the Hall of Fame here at Yankee Stadium. Now, that's a Hall of Fame when you've got a history yep. like the Yankees. Yeah, it really is, and I'll tell you, Cliff Lee's pitching like a Hall of Famer tonight. Think about it. He's had seven strikeouts in six innings and thrown only, only 86 pitches. That's economizing for a guy who struck out that many. And it's really the way he's doing it and against whom he's doing it because he's handled the middle part of this Yankee lineup. And he has been in charge just about since the first battery faced when he struck out Derek Jeter to start the bottom of the first. He has handled Rodriguez twice. With a pair of strikeouts. 
And he leads it off in the seventh inning and takes a ball. Rodriguez, Posada, Matsui. Ball and a strike. In game box score for the New York Yankees. Derek Jeter has two hits, a pair of singles for Posada and Matsui. Jeter has the only extra base hit for the Yankees, and that's brought to you by Fox Business Network, the new home of the American Dream on DirecTV Channel 359. That's to the third baseman, Feliz, who throws across for the out. And Alex Rodriguez is 0 for 3. Here comes Posada, who has a hit and a strikeout. Cliff Lee is picking up right where he left off against the Dodgers. And when he took on Los Angeles, he picked up right where he left off against the Colorado Rockies. Those are the steps the Phillies have taken to get to this point. Ball one inside. Earlier we talked about Cliff Lee and how he goes through that phantom throw to second base. And even when the guys are working on the mound, hey, get out of get out of my way. <laughs> Going through his his phantom pitch that he throws before warming up every half inning. Here's a pitch up and away 2 0. Oh. Posada. Would be followed by Matsui and Sabathia. Has exited the dugout as Phil Hughes continues to get warm in the bullpen. We'll take the eighth. There's a strike. And it's two and one. Check swing. Little comebacker to Cliff Lee who takes it himself and pats Posada on the backside as he sends Posada back to the dugout two out. So seven strikeouts on the night. And he has two quiet outs to start the seventh inning with Rodriguez and Posada. And Matsui digs his way in one for two. I think what you said earlier Joe about the Yankees being 36 and 8 since the All Star break. That's how well Cliff Lee is pitching tonight. You're going against a red hot team. Here in game one of the World Series in this ballpark. Leading the majors at home runs. He is just uh, lights out so far tonight. The Yankees have been shut out five times this season once here at home. That's off the end of the bat to Pedro Feliz. Just dominant pitching from Cliff Lee. We have played seven. Eighth inning now. Phillies coming up. They lead the Yankees 2-0. I'm what you call sans parents. Oh. I can go to a movie on a school night like that. In a theater? You should come over to my place. I've got direct TV. I get all the hottest movies in 1080p. <laughs> I'm what you call sans cable. For theater quality, picture and sound on every channel, call 1-800-DIRECT-TV. It looks like nothing else on the road right now, proclaims GQ Magazine. Did you see that? The interior positively oozes class, raves Car Magazine. Slick and sensuous, boasts the Washington Times, the most striking VW in recent memory, declares... Okay, I get it already. I think we were in a car commercial.
Sometimes being there means helping you afford everything a true fan needs. That's why State Farm has so many ways to save. So there's more for the little things. Hi, my name is... What? My name is... Who? My name is... It's, it's, it's named Shady. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the eighth wonder of the world. H to the Izzo. V to the Izzo. Hi. To the Izzo. What? The Izzo. H to the... H, H to the... Shady. H to the... Shady. That's the anthem. Holla Get your hands up. Jay-Z versus Eminem. One of 93 original mashups. DJ Hero. Rated T for Teen. The moves. The magic. <laughs> the music. We make a minute. Now, experience the movie event of a lifetime. Michael Jackson's This Is It. Rated PG. Tickets available at theaters everywhere. Just beautiful shots all night long of a ballpark that's as pretty outside as it is inside here in the Bronx. And the aerial coverage brought to you by DirecTV. For the most sports in HD, call 1 800 DirecTV. Phil Hughes takes over. He was terrific out of the bullpen. A 1.40. ERA and 44 relief appearances during the regular season. Postseason's been a little different. Pitched six games, has an ERA of 5.79. He's allowed three runs, nine hits, and four and two thirds innings. Jimmy Rollins first up took a ball, and now another. And Ken Rosenthal is still with us. From down on the field level, why do the Yankees want Phil Hughes to start an inning as opposed to coming in with somebody on base? Well, one advantage here, Joe, is that he starts innings clean out of the windup. And the Yankees have been asking Phil Hughes, hey, slow down, trust your stuff. Hughes told me it's easier for him to do that out of the windup than out of the stretch. He finds the strike zone here in the count two and one. And Joe Girardi is asked about it, and he let you in a little bit. He talks about the inexperience across his bullpen. Here's Rollins hitting one down the right field line, hooking into the corner. It's foul. He says, you know, you think about it. Phil Cope, a young guy. Robertson, a young guy. Aceves, young guy. Jabba, Phil Hughes. He said, I'm not complaining. They're all very good, but they're all very young as they make their way through this postseason and Bill Hughes has the count even on Jimmy Rollins two and two and the very young uh, Phil Hughes you see Java Chamberlain right there but he will probably be picked up by Damaso Marte who is warming and there's only one reason that Marte is warming or actually two reasons Utley and Howard who are due up third and fourth if Ryan Howard gets up in this inning switch hitter Victorino on deck. Two and two on Jimmy Rollins, who's 0 for 3. And a foul tip. Keeps him up there. It speaks to how well CC Sabathia has pitched this postseason. That when you say he went seven, allowed two runs on four hits, struck out six, walked three, two home runs allowed, that he had an off night. <laughs> Only thing that uh, has made his night an off night is Cliff Lee. Lee has pitched seven shutout innings and allowed three hits. Make it four. And now a leadoff walk from Phil Hughes. So the leadoff man is on. We look ahead to tomorrow night. 
as we play in this 2 0 game here in the eighth inning, game one. The matchup of Pedro Martinez got a no decision with seven innings of two hit shutout baseball against the Dodgers, against A.J. Burnett, three starts this postseason, an ERA of just under four and a half. If you think uh, Yankee Stadium was jumping tonight, wait till Lamar night with Pedro out there. Weather's supposed to be better. And they will see their old friend Pedro Martinez on the mound for the Phillies. Pedro Martinez saying today that I might be the only guy who brings fear to fans without throwing a pitch. <laughs> he can light up Yankee Stadium, old and new. And while the Yankees have to think, here we go again with Phil Hughes with a leadoff walk. Rollins starts and stops and ball one outside to Victorino. You get the feeling Rollins is going to start and start at first base. And the next time that fake break, he's going to keep going. Rollins with 31 steals on the year. Caught eight times. Talking to Davey Lopes, the first base coach. Torino 0 for 3 against Sabathia. Starts and stops on ball two to Shane Victorino. Just an embarrassment of riches is what a lot of people thought about the Yankees with their short relief getting to Mariano Rivera coming into this postseason with guys like Phil Hughes and Jabba Chamberlain out of the rotation down there and David Robertson and the way he had pitched and Phil Coke. But it hasn't been too sharp for that group. Mariano Rivera has been asked to do a lot already this postseason to get the Yankees to this spot. Including a two inning save on Sunday night to end the ALCS. There's ball three to Victorino. 3 0. Goes Rollins. The pitch is a strike. The throw down is not in time. And the first stolen base of this postseason for Jimmy Rollins. A 3 0 pitch allowed Victorino to put the bat in front of catcher Jorge Posada. That is a real distraction when you're trying to, when you're a catcher and you're trying to come out of the shoot in a hurry. 3 0, he knows he's going to take. And that little movement. Uh, can really distract a catcher and Rollins steals a base. Now the counts three and one and Victorino goes after a high fastball full count. You surprised at all that they were running on three and oh three and oh you normally don't run. Do you know who was one of the most proficient at running three and oh and making it Lou Brock one of the great stolen base champs of all time. Now a 3-2 pitch. Victorino stays alive. But you're right. If you, if you run 3-0, your percentage has to be much, much higher. You cannot be thrown out because the hitter's in such a favorable count. Now Jimmy Rollins and Derek Jeter share a smile. The two played together during the World Baseball Classic. And Rollins peppered Derek Jeter with questions. Here's a 3 2. And back to back walks to start the inning for Phil Hughes. That'll bring out Girardi. And Hughes with Utley coming up is coming out. The Yankees added another right handed reliever in Brian Bruni. 
for this World Series round and Phil Hughes comes in and walks the first two a stolen base mixed in. There's the moment between Rollins and Jeter and a pitching change in the eighth for New York. For guys, kidding is the highest compliment. Hey, everybody look at Gabe, bringing back the V-neck. Well done. That uh, top button is fighting for its life. I love the stash, but where'd you dock the steamboat? Hey, Steve, they make that shirt any tighter? Even Europe thinks your pants are too tight. Has he told you about his scrapbooking? But when the kidding ends, we reach for the beer that starts with full flavor and ends with a crisp, clean finish. It's what we do. Budweiser. These amigos! Now, bring home the movie that's number one in fun, number one in adventure, and number one in laughs. The important thing is that no one got hurt. Except for that guy. Ice Age Dawn of the Dinosaurs, the world's number one animated movie. HP printers and inks give you up to 65% more pages than bargain inks. Now that's an impressive bargain. I'm what you call sans parents. Oh. I can go to a movie on a school night like that. In a theater? You should come over to my place. I've got direct TV. I get all the hottest movies in 1080p. <laughs> I'm what you call... Sans cable. Ugh. For theater quality, picture and sound on every channel, call 1 800 Direct TV. Hey! You don't drive every time you smoke. Yet, you smoke every time you drive. Driving and smoking don't have to go together. Relearn life without cigarettes, free at becomeanx.org. A new way to think about quitting. Thomas Marte, the left-hander, takes over for Phil Hughes, who walked the first two batters of the inning and then was barking at the home plate umpire. On his way off the field, Jerry Davis. Meanwhile, it's Utley who has had a perfect night at the plate of walk, two home runs. And Marte gives a look back at Jimmy Rollins. Utley is the second left handed batter to hit two home runs, a left handed pitcher in a World Series game. The other one, wow, Babe Ruth. That's great. 1928 game four. Man. Instead of for the Yankees, it's against the Yankees, and it's Utley and not Babe Ruth. And Utley takes ball one down and away. The retired number of Babe Ruth is. Utley waits for a 1 0 pitch from Marte. And neither one have been close. 2 0 in this crowd, which has been packed in from the beginning and dealt with wind and rain, is starting to groan here with the erratic pitching of the Yankee bullpen. Two straight walks by Phil Hughes, and now two balls and no strikes to Chase Utley. On deck, Ryan Howard. Here's a 2-0. Two and one. Two and one, there's strike two. Chase Hudley thought it was outside, but Marte gets the call. Our unofficial look at it on Fox Tracks as Posada now goes out to talk to the 34 year old left hander, Damaso Marte. 
who pitched in only 21 games during the regular season had a one and three record and an ERA of nine point four five. Shoulder problems limiting him to only 21 appearances. The 2 2. And got him looking one away. Boy, did Marte drop that breaking ball in to Chase Utley after four fastballs? The curveball gets him. Good breaking ball. And here are the four fastballs. The first two miss. 2-0 pitch for a strike. 2-1 pitch, Utley thought outside, but the curveball gets it. In steps Ryan Howard. It's interesting because as we sit here, this does not feel like a 2-0 game. It doesn't feel like a two-run game. With the Yankees down by just two because of the pitching of Cliff Lee. Yeah, that's right. On the other hand, the Phillies have had questions around their bullpen all year because of the blown saves by their closer, Brad Lidge. That's in the air to right. Swisher back to get it. That's out number two. Tagging and going to third is Rollins. First and third, two out. Yeah, I, I, Joe, I think because of the pitch count of Cliff Lee, Charlie Manuel would be more inclined to stick with Lee certainly in the eighth and maybe even the ninth as Joe Girardi's not going to stick with Damaso Marte anymore. So Marte comes in gets two outs. Jason Worth is coming up. Robertson coming in Two nothing Philadelphia in the eighth. Depression is a serious medical condition that can take so much out of you. I feel like I have to wind myself up just to get out of bed. Then, well, I have to keep winding myself up to deal with the sadness, the loss of interest, the trouble concentrating, the lack of energy. If depression is taking so much out of you, ask your doctor about Pristique. Pristique is a prescription medicine proven to treat depression. Pristique is thought to work by affecting the levels of two chemicals in the brain, serotonin and norepinephrine. Tell your doctor right away if your depression worsens or you have unusual changes in mood, behavior, or thoughts of suicide. Antidepressants can increase suicidal thoughts and behaviors in children, teens, and young adults. Pristique is not approved for children under 18. Do not take Pristique with MAOIs. Taking Pristique with NSAID pain relievers, aspirin, or blood thinners may increase bleeding risk. Tell your doctor about all your medications, including those for migraine, to avoid a potentially life-threatening condition. Pristique may cause or worsen high blood pressure, high cholesterol, or glaucoma. Tell your doctor if you have heart disease or before you reduce or stop taking Pristique. Side effects may include nausea, dizziness, and sweating. For me, Pristique is a key in helping to treat my depression. Ask your doctor about Pristique. The world's most famous fairy <laughs> is back. Let's go. In her all-new adventure. None shall pass. Hold on. <laughs> Tinkerbell and the Lost Treasure. An all-new movie on DVD and Blu-ray combo pack today. Rated G. Authority of the Office of the Commissioner of Baseball may not be reproduced or retransmitted in any form, and the accounts and descriptions of this game may not be disseminated without express written consent. Well, this January, the greatest thrill ride on television is back for a brand new day, and it promises to be the most shocking, suspenseful story yet. Kiefer Sutherland stars in 24. The new season begins this January on Fox. Here's Robertson first and third two out trying to keep it a two nothing game it was first and second nobody out Marte did a nice job and now worth takes a ball a 
It's speed on Rollins over at third Victorino at first. Worth is one for two with a walk a strikeout and a base hit. Yeah what's going through Jorge Posada's mind right now is what to do with the ball in case Victorino runs. Do you throw through. Do you allow him to steal second base without a throw and if you throw through. Do you look Rollins back at third in the process. The 1 0. High from Robertson, who so far this postseason 2 0. No earned runs, three games. Three innings pitch, just two hits allowed. And now ball three as Robertson stares in at home plate umpire Jerry Davis. 3 0. That's why he stared in. So a 3 0 pitch is low, and that loads the bases for Ibanez. So three walks in this inning by the Yankee bullpen, and Dave Island will come out and talk with Ibanez coming up. Maybe a refresher on what the Yankees plan to do with Raul Ibanez, who's 0 for 3. He's grounded out, he's struck out twice. Don't forget on Sunday, a big day of sports here on Fox, all times Eastern at 1 o'clock, the Giants at the Eagles, big battle in the NFC East. Vikings at the Packers at 4.15 with Brett Favre's return to Green Bay. And then the Phillies. We'll be hosting the Yankees at 8 o'clock Eastern for game four at Citizens Bank Ballpark. This is a big at bat in this game. Phillies up 2 0 and have a chance to blow it open. But Banez at the plate and he takes a strike. Second time Ibanez has been up with the bases loaded tonight. Grounded out in the first inning when he had this chance. The 0 1. One ball, one strike. Strike two. Now the one two. And Ibanya stays up there. Here's a guy like David Robertson who only throws 91 miles per hour. And I say only because it appears that his fastball is about five miles an hour faster. He has swing and miss stuff, says Dave Island, the pitching coach of the Yankees. Led the American League in strikeouts per nine innings pitched during the regular season. His one two. Two and two. Robertson, who got out of a bases loaded, nobody out situation in the division series game two against the Twins, and got the victory when Teixeira went deep in the bottom of the 11th. Working to Ibanez here, game one of the World Series, bases loaded, two out. Two, two. To the right side and through. Base hit, Ibanez. In to score is Rollins. In to score is Victorino, and it's 4 0 Philadelphia. A ground ball that found a hole through the right side, and the Phillies double their lead here in the eighth. Think about the two strike hits by the Phillies tonight. Utley 
with two home runs on two strikes and now Abania strikes with two strikes. So all four runs tonight scored by the Phillies have been scored on hits with two strikes on the batter. So with that good speed two runs with Rollins and Victorino crossing home plate. Now Ben Francisco goes after a high fastball strike one. Those runs are charged to Phil Hughes. who didn't retire a batter. Face two, walk two, and allows two runs. If there was any pressure on Cliff Lee, and he hasn't looked at all tonight like he's had any on him since the beginning, that gives him a little more breathing room and as we talked about there have been problems during the regular season with this Phillies bullpen. There's a big hit. Now Rodriguez goes down on a knee makes the play and the inning is over. But damage is done back to back walks to start the inning two runs on only one hit in the frame. Bottom of the eighth game one four nothing Philadelphia. Lightning never strikes twice. Introducing the supercharged new BlackBerry Storm 2. Wi Fi enabled, ultra responsive, tons of apps. And because it runs on the network with five times more 3G coverage than ATT, it just may be the perfect storm. Frost brewed Coors Light. How cold is it? It's chilled down to 34 degrees for a taste as cold as the Rockies. It's aged cold, it's filtered cold, and it's served in cans, bottles, and glasses that tell you when it's cold. Why? Because refreshment isn't everything, it's the only thing. Frost Brewed Coors Light, the world's most refreshing beer. Let's get down to the nuts and bolts. You've got things to do. We've got the tools and hardware to get them done. And with new lower prices all through the store. So you can do more fixing, replacing, fastening, and updating for less. More saving, more doing. That's the power of the Home Depot. Right now, trade any power drill, working or not, for 15% off a new lithium ion drill. Little things can turn against you when you travel. But if they do, you know who to turn to. Your American Express Charge Card not only gives you assistance around the world. With the Membership Rewards Program, you can use points to travel without blackout dates on any airline, anytime. Can your card say that? There are engines. And then there's the twin turbocharging, 365 horsepower generating, EcoBoost engine, and the all-new Taurus Show from Ford that has the thirst of a V6 with the thrust of a V8. We speak car. We speak innovation. Introducing the all-new Taurus Show from Ford. Drive one. for the Philadelphia Phillies and has it paid off what he did in two divisional starts against Colorado 16 and a third two earned runs and he has not allowed a run since in 15 innings pitched against the combination of the Dodgers and the Yankees strike one on Robinson Cano Ryan Madsen getting loose for Philadelphia in their bullpen. Bottom three in the order for the Yankees for Cliff Lee who's allowed four hits seven strikeouts no walks and only one extra base hit 
That is picked up by Lee behind his back. And even he has to smile as he grabbed it. Hey, whatever, right behind his back for out number one. Look at this. Wow. And think about the blase catch that he made on Johnny Damon, the little pop up back to the mound. There's nothing blase about that play. I mean, his body language is like he's pitching in spring training. Yeah. Yeah, just getting his work in. Man. <laughs> Why wouldn't he smile? No runs, four hits. And strike one with one out in the eighth inning to Nick Swisher, who's now nine out of 58 in his career during the postseason. And that's ball one. Melky Cabrera next. Strike two. 100 pitches on the night for Cliff Lee. Well, you talk about a machine tonight. Man. Swishers popped up, fly to right. A big rip. Still one and two. And here are the two plays with the glove by Cliff Lee while he's done all the other work with his left arm. Just the easy catch. And now this one on a comebacker behind his back. A one two. Joe you talk about the reaction time on Fox Tracks Plus from a from a pitcher releasing the ball to a hitter. What about the reaction time on a ground ball hit that hard and Cliff Lee has to go behind his back to make the play. <laughs> Man. Big time. One and two on Swishers had two pretty good swings the last two deliveries against Cliff Lee. Two and two. You mentioned that the Yankees have been shut out once here at home in their new park during the 2009 season. It happened mid June, June 18th. The hands of all of all teams, the Washington Nationals. Three to nothing. Shutout victory shared between five pitchers. And Cliff Lee. Get strikeout number eight, two out in the inning. The World Series on Fox is sponsored by American Express. Don't take chances, take charge. By DJ Hero, 93 original mixes now in your hands. And by Ford, drive one. Talk about don't take chances, take charge. That's what Cliff Lee's done tonight. Here's strike one on Cabrera. He just keeps rolling on. And we've seen a couple of shots of Charlie Manuel down in that dugout. And he looks like he's having the time of his life down there. He does. Very relaxed. Really very intense. And Cabrera flies one into center. Cliff Lee has made this look easy. We go into the ninth game one all Cliff Lee who's doing it with his arm with his glove behind his back. He's been a magician for nothing Philadelphia. Will you find your dad's smile in aisle 14? A long awaited journey in aisle 10. Yeah. Because when you save money on the little things, it adds up to life's more amazing things. Walmart saves the average family $3,100 a year, no matter where you shop. What will you do with your savings? Save money, live better. Walmart. Taco Bell's fully loaded nachos. Piled high with toppings like seasoned beef and nacho cheese sauce so there's never a naked chip. And for a buck more, grab an extra large drink and make it a fully loaded deal. Think outside the bun. 
Chuck's going to show us how simple it is to earn cash back. Talk about simple. Earn cash back on purchases to pay down your credit card or go into savings with the Power Rewards Visa credit card, only from Bank of America. Ebenezer Scrooge has a special gift just for you. Nothing. Jim Carrey is Scrooge. You will be haunted by three spirits. I'd rather not. On November 6th, the classic tale becomes a 3D adventure like nothing you've ever seen. <laughs> From the director of Forrest Gump and the Polar Express. <laughs> Disney's A Christmas Carol. Rated PG in Disney Digital 3D and IMAX 3D. There was a town held captive by an evil gas pump. It fed on people's hard-earned money. But along came the Michelin Man, who reminded them the right tire changes everything. And with fuel-efficient tires in place, that evil gas pump wasn't so evil anymore. Michelin Energy Saver AS tires can help save up to 109 gallons of fuel. Michelin, a better way forward. You're supposed to call me Grandpa. You look like a Grandpa. I couldn't agree with you more. I want to move back to Los Angeles with you. Dad, I don't know what to say. Come here. <laughs> what are you doing here? I have information. There's a big hit going down. I don't work for the government anymore. President Hassan at the UN. He's getting taken out. Today. Jack Bauer's on line three. We need to pay attention to this. This January. Go! Go! We're under attack. We are cold red. This is going down now. Innocent lives are at stake. Keeper Sutherland. This is over! You're lucky I'm retired. 24. A new day begins this January on Fox. Brian Bruni was added to the active roster for the Yankees for this third round of the playoffs the World Series there is numbers from the regular season 5 and 0 3.92 on the disabled list two times at a strained muscle in his elbow hard throwing right hander he misses with a 95 mile an hour fastball ball 2 2 and 0 started the season wearing number 38 on his back. Changed his number in the middle of September to 99. Belize first up 2 0 pitch. 2 and 1. Belize then Ruiz then Jimmy Rollins for the Phillies who lead 4 0 here in game one. Ninth inning. And a pop up. Right side for Robinson Cano, who makes the play. One out. Tonight's Walmart saving moments of the game. While Cliff Lee has done his part on the mound, to say the least, Chase Utley has done his part at the plate. Against the lefty, CC Sabathia. Going deep twice, once in the third, once in the sixth. On base three times in this game and responsible for two of the four runs put up by the Phillies here in game one. Here's Ruiz. Yankees in their half of this ninth inning will have the top of their order. That's why that hit by Ibanez was so big. A two out two run single last inning. Which took it from 2-0 to 4-0. To Girardi will send in Jeter, Damon, and Teixeira. You talk to the Philadelphia Phillies pitchers about Carlos Ruiz. They love to pitch to him. He absorbs things behind the plate. And when you're 0 for 3 as a catcher batting in the ninth inning that is very satisfying when you consider that you are catching a shutout. And it looks at the moment like Lee will go back out there. Here's a shot into left center field off the bat of Ruiz. He'll dig into second base with a double. 
And Carlos Ruiz is on with one out. And he gets his first World Series hit of 2009. Well, the cake is a shutout by Cliff Lee. The icing is a double by Carlos Ruiz. That is his seventh base hit during this postseason on the road in 17 at bats and he's at second with one out for Jimmy Rollins. Popped up foul back and out of play in case you're wondering the winner of game one the winning team has won each of the last six World Series. Phillies are three defensive outs away from winning game one as Phil Coke the left hander gets loose. Here's the 0 1. Ball and a strike on a 97 mile an hour fastball. I couldn't help but notice the batting glove on the left hand of Charlie Manuel. He is such a hitter's manage manager that he even wears a batting glove while he's managing. <laughs> he said if I'm going to manage a team I need a strong pitching coach and he has one in Rich Doobie. Doobie is the pitching coach and Charlie Manuel is a longtime hitting coach. Mm -hmm. 65 year old Charlie Manuel in his fifth season as manager of the Phillies. A world champion last year. That's a squirter for a base hit. An infield base hit for Jimmy Rollins. He gets his first hit of this game one. Right off the end of the bat. And it's first and third with only one out. Sometimes the ball has a mind of its own. You have nothing to do with it. As Rollins plops one about 70 feet down the third baseline. <laughs> Sets up Shane Victorino, and here comes Joe Girardi jogging out to talk. But looking like he is not in the mood to make a pitching change, and he will not. Game two is tomorrow night. And it's a pitching matchup of Pedro Martinez and A.J. Burnett on the air at 7.30 Eastern. Don't forget during our pregame, we come on the air at 7.30. Jay-Z and Alicia Keys will be performing here at Yankee Stadium. That's tomorrow night. And then some fireworks you can bet with Pedro Martinez getting the ball for Philadelphia. You know it's a good play at second base Robinson Cano is not halfway for the double play. He's in about three more steps and the reason for that is Victorino only grounded into five double plays during the regular season. So on a ball hit to Cano he's got to make sure he can get the double play otherwise come home with the slower Ruiz on at third base. There's ball one to Victorino. Who walked and scored his last time, hitless in this game. But seven RBIs this postseason. An infielder in a situation like this is almost like a driver pulling from a stop sign, where you have to determine the speed of the cars coming the opposite way. Well, you have to determine the speed of the ball hit to know whether to go to second or home. That uh, base hit through the right side and another run for Philadelphia. Five to nothing here in the ninth inning as three straight hits from Ruiz, Rollins, and Victorino have added to the Phillies' lead. And that's going to be it for Bruni. Joe Girardi makes the call. Phil Coke is coming in. Chase Utley is coming up. And the Phillies are rolling here in game one. Two on, one out, leading 5 nothing over the Yankees. Take your time to find the right time with Cialis for daily use. 
a clinically proven low-dose tablet for erectile dysfunction you take every day. So you can be ready anytime the moment is right. Tell your doctor about your medical condition and all medications, and ask if you're healthy enough for sexual activity. Don't take Cialis if you take nitrates for chest pain, as this may cause an unsafe drop in blood pressure. Don't drink alcohol in excess with Cialis. Side effects may include headache, upset stomach, delayed backache, or muscle ache. To avoid long-term injury, seek immediate medical help for an erection lasting more than four hours. If you have any sudden decrease or loss in hearing or vision, stop taking Cialis and call your doctor right away. 36-hour Cialis or Cialis for daily use. Ask your doctor about Cialis today, so when the moment is right, you can be ready. It looks like nothing else on the road right now, proclaims GQ Magazine. Did you see that? The interior positively oozes class, raves Car Magazine. Slick and sensuous, boasts the Washington Times, the most striking VW in recent memory, declares... Okay, I get it already. I think we were in a car commercial. FoxSports.com and MLB.com are bringing you up to four alternate camera angles of the World Series live online at postseason.tv. Here's Phil Coke. The lefty takes over with Utley coming up. Three straight hits for Philadelphia. And it's 5 nothing Phillies in the ninth inning. A chance for more. Great speed on. And hitting hero at the plate for the Phillies Utley who's homer twice drawn a walk two for three two on one out ball one on the other side of it in case you're wondering the Yankees have never been shut out in game one of a World Series and this is the 40th time that they have played game one of a World Series. A 1-0 pitch. It's a strike from Phil Coke. We open up that microphone at the second base bag and you can hear Derek Jeter as he's done throughout this postseason. Talking through the runner at second in this case Jimmy Rollins to the pitcher Phil Coke. Keep Rollins close with Utley at the plate. Stays quiet that time on ball two outside to Utley. You could almost see Derek Jeter flailing that glove toward Phil Cope as saying, It's okay, go ahead. Two, Two pitches ago. Mix it up. When Jeter is telling a pitcher like that to mix it up, he, he means that don't just look at the at the runner at second base and then go home and then look at the runner and then go home mixing it up means look back then go home and then look back twice and then go home. So what he's mixing up are the looks at second base not his pitches.
two one pitch is down and away so while worrying about Jimmy Rollins and listening to Derek Jeter and what have you the counts gone to three and one on Utley. Babe Ruth homer three times in a World Series game two times and of course Reggie Jackson the Dodgers on the other end. Mr. October at the park tonight. 3 1 pitches, pop foul, back and out of play, full count. Again, the Yankees will have the top of their lineup to the plate in the bottom of this ninth inning. Barring a huge comeback, they'll hand the ball to Burnett tomorrow against Pedro Martinez down again in this World Series. Three two fly ball in the air to right center for Cabrera. That's out number two tagging going to third is Rollins first and third two out. So Utley retired for the second straight time and it's up to Ryan Howard. the while Cliff Lee looks like he's barely broken a sweat as he's pitched the first eight innings allowing no runs on four hits eight strikeouts no walks and he'll head back out there. The Yankees were shut out in their last World Series game which was game six in 2003 by Josh Beckett. Then of the Florida Marlins, two to nothing at the old Yankee Stadium. So their scoreless streak is now 17 straight innings in World Series baseball. First and third, two out, and strike one on Ryan Howard. Top of the order will try and change all that. Against Cliff Lee. The next is over but low. Ryan Howard with four straight years of 40 plus home runs and 130 plus RBIs. 45 home runs this year, only seven against left handed pitching. But tremendous power the other way. The 1 1 pitch. Is ripped into right field. That's a base hit. And more. It goes all the way to the wall. Into score is Rollins. They're going to wave Victorino to the plate. Throw by Cano. In time, and that ends the inning. But another run is on the board for Philadelphia. And it's 6 0 Phillies as we go to the bottom of the ninth inning. Top of the order coming up for the Yankees, dealing with Cliff Lee. The out at the plate that ends the top of the ninth. Six zip Philly. When you buy a car, what are you really buying? A shiny coat of paint? A list of features? What about the strength of the steel? The integrity of its design? Or how it responds in extreme situations? The deeper you look, the more you see the real differences. And the more you understand what it means to own a Mercedes Benz, the C Class. See your authorized Mercedes-Benz dealer for special offers through Mercedes-Benz Financial. Hi. What can I get for a dollar? That's yours. How far can I get with this? You can get out. Hi. What can I get for this? How about two sizzling 100% pure beef patties with all the amenities and a meaty, melty McDouble? Or maybe an irresistible McChicken, golden fries, or any of the fabulous dollar menu tastes that are always here for you. Huh? Wow. The dollar menu every day, only at McDonald's. Hi, I'm Steve. A while ago, I had this idea. All the stuff in my house should just work together. Well, Windows 7 comes out, and you know what? Now it does. Now documents from my work PC can print over there, and music from that computer we can listen to on that computer. The stuff we watch over here, we can watch over here. 
My little ideas come to life. I know I shouldn't take all the credit, but it's my house. Hey, get off the table. I'm a PC, and Windows 7 was my idea. HP printers and inks give you up to 65% more pages than bargain inks. That's not just talk, that's a real bargain. There's no substitute for the best. Energizer Ultimate Lithium. Keep going. What a night for Cliff Lee. And he will try to finish what he started. Mentioned the Josh Beckett shutout. That's also the last complete game shutout, period, in the World Series. It was game six at Yankee Stadium. And it'll be the top of the order. That means Jeter, Damon, and Teixeira against Lee. Ryan Matson getting loose. He would take over if Cliff Lee has any issues at all. Here in the bottom of the ninth inning. 106 pitches to this point in the night. First pitch swinging, strike one on Jeter. What an atypical game the Yankees are playing here at the, their new home. Four base runners tonight. And in no inning did they have more than one. No walks by Lee. So far, a masterpiece. One of the base runners erased in a double play as Jeter takes strike two. That's in the dirt. You can bet that Jackson Lee, Cliff Lee's eight year old son, is down in Benton, Arkansas, watching dad try and finish this game here at Yankee Stadium. Jackson is the older brother to sister Macy. What a statement by Lee and the Phillies here tonight as Jeter flares one into center. In comes Victorino. It's a base hit. And Jeter is on to start the ninth inning, and we'll see if the Phillies go any deeper into this game with Cliff Lee. Well, I think you let Cliff Lee pitch to Johnny Damon. Victorino can't corral it. You at least allow Lee a chance to pitch to Damon. Even though Ryan Madsen is ready in the bullpen, I don't think you bring him in now. So Damon will bat. He's 0 for 3. And not only is it lefty on lefty, but we've talked about the fact that Damon is 2 out of 25 now in his career against Lee. And he has not hit the ball hard tonight. Takes a ball. Damon lines a base hit into right, and the Yankees trying to get up off the map here in the ninth inning. Two on, nobody out. To Shera coming up. On deck is Alex Rodriguez. Out to the mound goes Carlos Ruiz with Ryan Madsen getting loose. In a six to nothing game. Joe Girardi now is thinking about the runs that his bullpen has allowed here 
over the last two innings. Four runs, two in the eighth, two in the ninth. Yeah, those tack on runs lose a lot of ball games. I think Charlie Manuel allowing Lee to pitch to Teixeira because Teixeira has struck out twice and popped a second tonight. After the high delivery, strike one. Teixeira in his postseason career is a 118 hitter with runners in scoring position. He has Jeter at second, Damon at first. Nobody out. And that's up the middle. Utley flips out over to first. The throw into the dugout. There goes the shutout. Jeter will come to the plate in a six to one game. And down to second is to Shara. Jimmy Rollins trying to do too much instead of planning and throwing to first base. To is not a fast runner. Rollins tries to hurry his throw. Gets off on the wrong foot. Watch the right foot throw. Normally, a shortstop will try to pivot. I think Rollins had a little more time than he thought. So a throwing error on the part of Rollins in here. Cliff Lee allowed to pitch to Alex Rodriguez. Six to one, Philadelphia. It's a force out at second base, and then an error on Jimmy Rollins, his second of the postseason. That's the first error of the night. Now Ruiz goes out to talk. Notice how deliberate Chase Utley was on that ball. Infielders are trained to make sure of one when you're leading by six in the ninth inning. So it was a good job by Utley to make sure of that lead runner at second base. One hundred fourteen pitches on the night for Cliff Lee. And he will throw at least 115. A Rod, strike one. Pretty good zip, 90 mile an hour fastball. Rodriguez 0 for 3 tonight with a pair of strikeouts and a ground out. Strike two. Still throwing hard here is Cliff Lee in the ninth. Ball one. A one two to Rodriguez and he strikes out for the third time tonight and for Cliff Lee strikeout number nine. Once again Alex Rodriguez entered this game with a 438 batting average in the postseason five home runs 12 RBIs and Cliff Lee a left hander to the right handed hitter has struck him out three times. As it stands right now, still no earned runs against Cliff Lee. Posada up, runner at second, two out, strike one. Only run so far scoring on the throwing error by Jimmy Rollins. Share it second two out in the 0 1 fouled back and now Cliff Lee is a strike away from a complete game and I'm going to say that our radar gun just malfunctioned unless Cliff Lee threw a pitch 99. <laughs> I agree with that the legend grows <laughs> the 0 2 still 0 2. 
That's more like it. 91, still good velocity. So much for the six day layoff for the Philadelphia Phillies. They lead here by five in the bottom of the ninth inning, and Cliff Lee has allowed only two earned runs in 33 postseason innings. Ends it with a strikeout of Jorge Posada. And total. Dominance on the part of the left hander Cliff Lee, who was sensational here tonight for Philadelphia. What an exhilarating performance by Cliff Lee. In this postseason, 33 and a third innings pitched, two earned runs, no earned runs here tonight on a 122 pitch night. And a full nine from Cliff Lee. And clearly, he is the American Express take charge player of the game. So here, Charlie Manuel will say, way to throw the ball, man. And that is the understatement of the. and protect your legal rights. I thought it was crazy feeding in the fall. I always feed in the fall, but it's the best time. Feed your lawn in the fall. The fall feeding makes all the difference in the world. What the fall feeding does is build the roots. That's when the roots sort of want nutrition. I give my lawn Scott's Winter Garden. It's like a root building machine. It builds your lawn from the roots up. Next year, you get this. The stronger the roots, the stronger the lawn all year long. The best time to feed is when it'll do the most good. There's no substitute for the fall feeding, trust me. It is the best thing you could do for your lawn. I use Scott's Winter Garden. If you had a mouse in your home, you'd trap it. Well, you have things like dust mite debris, bacteria, pollen, and mold spores circulating in the air in your home. A Filtrate high-performance filter traps 90% of them. An ordinary filter, just 20%. 90 versus 20. It's your home. Trap them. Trust Filtrate filters, the filter brand people trust most. Go to Filtrate.com and save $3 with mail-in rebate. Yaz and Yasmin birth control pills have been associated with increased risk of stroke, pulmonary embolism, deep vein thrombosis, heart attack, and gallbladder disease. If you or a loved one have suffered from Yaz or Yasmin side effects, call 1-800-LAW-3333 and protect your legal rights. In February, the world will gather in the spectacular city of Vancouver as the brightest stars in winter sports compete for country in pursuit of Olympic gold. The 21st Olympic Winter Games, live this February on the networks of NBC. Welcome to the ADT NBC Sports Update. Here's your host, Jimmy Roberts. Well, hi again, everyone. Happy Halloween. We welcome you inside our New York studio. Coming up in just a few minutes, NBC's World of Adventure Sports. And then at 5 o'clock Eastern, it's poker's hottest show, Face the Ace. And tonight, at a special time and place, it's Notre Dame football, the Irish and Washington State from the Alamo Dome in San Antonio at 7.30 Eastern. Well, the Irish are 5-2, and two, coming off a thrilling win over Boston College last week. Tonight, Notre Dame is a four-touchdown favorite. 
With more, here's Alex Flanagan in San Antonio. More than 1,300 miles from South Bend, Indiana, is the site of tonight's Notre Dame-Washington State game. Welcome to the Alamo Dome in San Antonio, Texas, where Notre Dame is playing the first in a series of neutral off-site games to be played over the next few years. Notre Dame coming off of six straight games that have been decided in the final few minutes, and the Irish